mm. kwa ilikuwa ni pack road eh pack road gari unapata eh unapata ilikuwa ni mtaa wa indi eh so wa indi walikuwa wanacheza cricket sana yeah. so vitu zilikuwa zimetuzingira sana ni viwanja vya ni viwanja vya cricket mm. so nimecheza cricket sana mm-hmm. na naweza sema nilikuwa mzuri sana kuliko vile nilikuwa nacheza ball mm. but um, after kwenda seko Mm. Ndio nikakuja nikaacha na mambo ya cricket. Mhm. Hiyo mm. ilikuwa ni eh nikiuliza mwaka hii ilikuwa mwaka gani hiyo? Hizo 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 ni 80s eh. Hizo eh. ni 80s. All right. Eh. Okay, so wewe ulikuwa msewa cricket because I think yeah. pale paki eh, mm. ilikuwa ni kama uchezi ball uko kwa cricket and, 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 and cricket. I can only imagine I think the uh, Sizenyu mm. cricket ilikuwa big sana hiyo area sio? kabisa. In fact hata nimecheza na wachezaji wenyewe wamesikika sana kwa cricket. Mm. Kuna wachezaji na kina Maurice Maurice Sodumbe nimecheza na yeye kina Steve Tikolo. Mm-hmm. Nimecheza na kina Peter Ongondo. Mm-hmm. Nimecheza na kina Kamande, Udo Kamande yeye ni mdogo kiasi eh. Mm-hmm. Tulicheza na kina Maurice. So kina Suji yeye kisikia tu kina Suji mm. au tumecheza na cricket. Alafu cricket yetu ilikuwa funny by the way. Mm. Tulikuwa tunacheza na usogoro na bat. Usogoro unajua ni zile maze ball. So hizo ni tu... eh. So hizo ndio tulikuwa tunatumia kama maybe kama ball ya cricket eh. Yes. Na yenye to sharpen sana in terms of skills za cricket. Mm. Mm. Captain Vivi Bramo, wasemaje baba? Tangu Samiti, niko. Samiti. Kujawana ah, tangu kongo, Samiti. Na... Niko, niko, niko na fedha tu mashughuli mtaani. Eh. Ya kwa majina naitwa Musa Utiene Utero. Eh. Nimezaliwa kwa familia ya watu 11. Eh. Malingo. Watu wangapi? Ya na 11. Ai Buda. Eh. Na demo alikuwa mmoja. And then mimi ni kijana wa saba. Wee. So inakuambia tu ni family kwa ya sports. Mbole ni kila kitu. Mm. Eh yeah, ni mwanzi ya amateur team nimechezea katika team ka Jita Bejoz. Mm-hmm. Kwanza before ni chezee Bejoz nimekuwa anacheza hapo Kongo kwa team moja Jita Alpha Salvo. Mm-hmm. Boli yangu ya mtuchezea sana Alpha Salvo Kongo. Mm. Nikachezea amateur team Bejoz, nikachezea mm-hmm. Intercontinental. Mm-hmm. And then nika join FC. FC nika join Breweries before tani join FC kwanza nilitrain na Gold kidogo pre-season. Right. Ndio nikasign FC. Mm-hmm. And then uh, nika Breweries toka Breweries uh, Santos. Mm-hmm. Santos Sanda Cleveland Ohio. Sa- Santos Salam ya yeah. ndio nikaenda Cleveland Ohio. Nika right. retire at the age of 37. Ngoja ulitaya mapema sana. Ah Africa 37 ilikuwa normal. Eh hey, kwa cheza ball kifika 28 28 years 29 unatoka Ronaldo wajaluo na ma, na waluya pale kwa kwa nini naomba. Africa ukisha magoti yako imesaa kuisa. Mimi nakwambia ni pressure, pressure. Ilva Ilva Bram eh yeah. Musa amenikumbusha kitu moja. Unajua yeah, wachezaji wa Kenya wengi wao wakishafika mm. kitu 30 mm. unapata mtu uachishwe ball. Mhm. It's said utakuwa na uachishwe ball na coach Yeah. Ama it said utakuwa unawachishwa ball na players wenzako lakini mostly hizo time mm. ulikuwa unawachishwa ball na na fans. Wewe ingia ground bram. Yes sir. Unaingia ground mm. kwanza ni matusi. Uh-huh. Unaambiwa wachia vijana mpira. Unajua ukishaambiwa wachie vijana mpira hata mm. ile saiki ya kucheza ball yenyewe inaisha. So mm. any fans wali contribute sana kuachisha players wale wange fuck kuacha ball mapema. Yes. Na, na pia kidogo na Jobram tutakuwa tunaweza kwa kwa, kwa tofiki kidogo nafikiri hata hiyo age ya 30 unapata mm. mtu amefikisha 30 years anaona kuna kitu amefanya una get mm. so pressure inaingia <coughs> in terms of investment you unaanza kwa maiza kabisa unaona mtu mm. anabidi tu awache tu ball una get so mm. unapata unafika 29 30 mtu anasema kama uko Kenya unasema acha niwache lakini ukipata kama uko nje una mm. check una at 30 31 sasa uko machua unajua kuna mtu anaweza kutisha mafaa anaweza yeah, kutisha unajua kama unajua unajua kama ujua ujui Mm. Eh, mi unajua leo eh, mimi si mwenyesho eh, uwezi kuwa na jina kama Musa Utieno eh. Sami Omolo uwezi kuwa na jina kama iko panel na mimi ni Kabram tu hapa nimekaa hapa nimechakaa ati sana mimi ndio mnaniambia ni bonge zi leo show ni yenu mimi ni ma legend i think eh, watu wengi sana wanatakusikia sana kutoka kwenu so leo mimi naongea kidogo sana leo mm-hmm. itakuwa ni nyinyi mnanipeleka na rada mkiniambia ni nyamaze na nyamaza but kuna so many people want to 
want to ask you questions. I think we'll come to that later on. But before we start, kuna jamaa wangu mwingine hapa anaitwa Kenneth Wesonga Juma. Um ana celebrate birthday yake leo. Unajua inakuwa fiti sasa so zingine kama mtu ana turn a year older ile tu kum, kum <coughs> birthday. So Kenneth Wesonga Juma, happy birthday to you. Uh, kama uko na keki unaweza tuambia pale uko na leta ama legend pia wa kusaidia kukata keki. And then uh, Otesha na 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 Musa uh, at Otesha na Otesha na Musa. Otesha na Otesha na Pamzo. Kabla tuanze show uh, kuna vitu vingi sana zimekuwa zikiapen kwa world na maybe at some point nini watu mm. pia Mayolo, mecheza uh, Pamzo mecheza India, Otesha mm. mecheza South Africa. Kuna huyu jamaa anaitwa Floyd, Floyd George uh, mm-hmm. ambaye uh, alikuwa alimadwa ali juzi na ma, na Makarau uko states. He mm. may create a very mm. big uh, big uh, uh, riots uko state uh, England mm-hmm. pia kumekuwa na riots so i think mm-hmm. pia at some point na nimeileta size because most of the time you saw hizi vitu at some point mm-hmm. pia show iki, iki proceed na ni kitu ndio mm-hmm. sana to address kama ni kitu mm-hmm. pia mshaifes kwa kwa career zee mm-hmm. so nataka to roll mm-hmm. pamzo tupeleke mm-hmm. rada tupeleke na rada na manini zako ma Letwaje career career achievements pale ulianza mm-hmm. ball mm-hmm. the coach teams gani tunaweza yeah. kupata wapi na vitu kama hizo mm-hmm. just for for two minutes okay mm-hmm. safi brown mimi kwanza ball naweza sema nilianza pale ngara mm-hmm. apo park road manake vile nimekuambia tu ilikuwa ni area cricket eh? yeah. lakini unapata tulikuwa gana park ya juu mm-hmm. na park ya chini so mm-hmm. mimi nilikuwa gana park ya chini na paki ya chini sana sana ilikuwa ina ina inajulikana kucheza ball. Paki ya juu ina ina boita. Paki ya chini boita sasa ilikuwa katikati lakini yeye alikuwa anacheza pia cricket sana. Uzalikuwa alikuwa amependa ball. Mm. So unapata ndio pale paki kulikuwa hiyo paki ya chini kulikuwa na watu wanacheza ball lakini hawaku hawakuonekana hawakwenda sana kwa ball mm. vile mimi nili, niliendelea. Mm. Lakini unapata um, kulikuwa pia na ngara. Sa ngara ilikuwa ni area ya ilikuwa ni area ya ilikuwa ni nga, railway unapata watu railway eh kule railway walikuwa na sizabol sana so unapata nilikuwa natoka park ya chini nikienda mm. kule ngara maana yake ilikuwa mbali sana so yes. pale kulikuwa ga sana 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 tunacheza sana ball pale desta alipo ni tode zamani yake ilikuwa ni ground ya eh ilikuwa ni ground ya hockey eh mm. so from there ndio nika join ngara youth mm. then uh, kutoka ngara youth nika join maji fc maji fc ni mchezo hiyo peliko tu mmoja akakuja akachange yeah kutoka hapo ndio nikaingia kwa timu ya mzee ya Maji FC unaona hii Maji FC mm. ilikuwa ni timu ya timu ya Gava maana yake right. budango alikuwa anafanya na, na ministry of water na yeye okay. alikuwa alikuwa mdosi hapo hivyo mm. so unapata automatically niko mm. shule lakini niko nachezea nilikuwa nachezea Maji FC mm-hmm. so hapo yeye in fact ndio nikakuja nikanua talent yangu kutoka hapo hivyo Mm. nikaenda okay nilikuwa nacheza niki nikuwa chuo bado mm. lakini sasa kutoka hapo hivyo kutoka maji fc mm. nikakuja nika join Kenya Breweries ile inaitwa mm. Sai Tasca yes. so Tasca tulicheza hapo nilikuwa na wachezaji wazuri sana wale tulijoin nao kina Vincent Warula hiyo ilikuwa mwaka gani nao hapo hii ilikuwa ni 90s so immediately right. after kumaliza chuo so tukaanza mm. 90s okay so kuchi, nikachezea Tasca mm-hmm. for two years mm. chezea Tasca for two years Mm-hmm. nikaenda nika join gor eh, two th- i mean uh, 93 nika join gor back 94 so gor nika wacheza for another nika wacheza another two seasons mm-hmm. then 90 95 nika rudi nika nika rudi nika rudi task eh, Kenya Breweries mm-hmm. so kutoka Kenya Breweries nika cheza nika cheza mm-hmm. then um, 97 mm-hmm. nikaenda East Bengal all right East Bengal nika Chezea East Bengal for two seasons. Mm. Then kuchezea East Bengal for two seasons hiyo ni 97 98 kutoka mm-hmm. hapo nikakuja nikachezea Monbagan nikawa join rivals wao. Mm. So basically India nilicheza mm. for four seasons. So right. kutoka pale India mm. eh, kutoka pale India kitu 98 2000 nikakuja mm. nikakuja Gormaya. So kuja in Gor nikawa join mm. kama eh, kama player. Then hiyo ndio ile hiyo ndio ilikuwa ile team yenu mkiwa na kina pro sio? Exactly. Mm-hmm. Pro ni mbele kidogo, pro mbele ni badai kidogo. Oh, so okay. iti ilikuwa ni kina kina ilikuwa kina Ziko na kina Polochen. Okay. Mm. 
Sasa kutoka hapo mm. ikajipa tu. Hizo zingine tuongea baadaye. Hizo zingine tuongea show wiki endelea Oteshe. Mm. Yeah, by, 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 by the way Oteshe, Oteshe ndio the official uh, ambassador wa Karamoja Super Cup. Hiyo ni kama kama tujaongea <laughs> lakini hivyo ni kumeenda buda itabidi uitikie tu. So yeah, Oteshe yeah, 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 <laughs> <laughs> sema sema kuna jamaa anaitwa John Opala John Opala anasema ambia Otero ile bezi yetu ya Pop Cup High Rise wamefungua so ukienda kula alifunga yeye alikuwa kula... anapika ukienda kula hapo kaswain lazima uniite <laughs> <laughs> so teshe tupeleke yeah so Abraham vile nimekwambia mimi nitoka hmm. kwa nimetoka kwa familia watu 11 i think uh, Buda Buda naye alikuwa carpenter Buda kucheza sport yote hmm. mother lakini enzi zake alicheza neti So mm-hmm. I think rafikiria tulichukua tu ni ya, netball. Ya netball yeah netball right. mm. so lakini alikuwa anacheza huko ushago sana unaona unaona mm. mm. sawa unapata mimi ni kijana wa saba kwa family tuko mm. la dem tu moja mm. so inakuambia hiyo ni family ilikuwa ni ya wachezaji because ball ilikuwa kila kitu kwa family yetu unaona so mimi mm. nilikuwa nasikiliza kama tuma stories za mabro eh ni aje sio alichapati gani unaona mm. so unafikiria ama cha timu yangu kwanza nikianza mdogo Mm. Bili kwa anacheza timu moja ajita Alpha Salva huko makongeni unaona mm-hmm. bele mm-hmm. tuenda tulicheza naye sana boli yangu kwanza nime nimeanza upewa kitambo sana hiyo mm-hmm. nikikuwa miaka tisa kumi mm-hmm. nilikuwa natembea kutoka Maringo mpaka makongeni nachezea mm-hmm. hiyo timu ajita Alpha Salvo hiyo ndio ilikuwa pro hiyo ndio ilikuwa pro kwa sababu nilikuwa hey. ni, ni, ni hapo kwa watu wadogo lakini upro ilikuwa ishaanza hey. alafu amecha team 89 nikikuwa stradi 8 Dr. Craft uh-huh. nikachezea Intercontinental Mm. ilikuwa under coach Basanga. Mhm. 90 ni King of Fajerico bado mm. nikachezea Intercontinental na nikachezea mm. Bijoz. Mm-hmm. So 92. Mm. 92 sasa kulikuwa na timu moja inajiita Gormaya. Gormaya na tuko nikapiga eh nikapiga nao pre-season. Eh? I think hapo uh, ndio ni limit pamzo. Mm-hmm. Na I think uh, Gor at that time Mm. wali nafikiri wali sleki mm. kwa sababu walikuwa hata kama mambo ya kesho kesho mm-hmm. goro wakanipeleka nikapiga goro nikaenda na goro Rwanda mm. ndio i think that was my first international match kucheza mm. ndio nakwambia pamzo ni icon wangu ni mm. role model wangu mm-hmm. nilicheza na pamzo as number 4 na 5 Rwanda mm. game yangu ya kwanza lakini okay. yeye alikuwa na kajagada tu lakini mimi nachukua tu bola la chenga watu wapo nyuma so i think yeah. <laughs> eh, I think kutoka hapo eh <laughs> kutoka hapo yeye alipata ile confidence ya right. naweza una get yeah. so tulipotoka Rwanda na Gori ilikuwa 1992 tukarudi mm-hmm. Kenya mm-hmm. zile Gori walikuwa wacheza na team za hiyo kitambo Kenya watu walikuwa wanataka kwenda ga Oman sana yeah so that time nikizia Gori nilikuwa na Maknandwa mhm na nakwambia kusema ukweli yeye nilimweka kwa mfuko so uh-huh. ilikuwa una Wednesday Mm. Ora sato gora liko ni tiwa ni sign. Mm. Na huko kwa tu kwa terraces. Eh. Hey. Isiwa e ni gora ni goje Saturday on Friday sio kuja na na na, na chapa mzuri. Pake. I think one of the th- I think walikuja na kile kitu FC yenyewe walikuja nazo walinitaka kunipa ya school fees unaona? Mm. Alright. Some allowances zile nikakubali. Mm. Nikacheza FC for two years. Mm. Nikaenda breweries. Breweries nikacheza for two years. Mm. And then nikaenda Santos. Mm. Santos nayo nilipiga for 15 good years. Mm. Nikaenda kumaliza tu mm. ndio nikaenda kwa team moja huko Ohio, Steto mm. na jita Cleveland City Stars. Mm. Na nikicheza nikicheza huko sana ndio the birth of City Stars ilitokea kwa sababu nilikuwa gani nimechezea ga City Stars au Cleveland City Stars au Ohio. Mm. So nikikuja nilikuwa vice chairman wa wa City Stars. Nairobi vile kulienda hiyo ni story ya siku nyingine. Eh. Si, tuambie leo walikuliendaje? What, hap- what happened? <laughs> Ah ilikuwa tu upande wa funding kwa sababu mbeje anasema kama nilikuwa vice chairman at that time mm. nafikiria hiyo siku nilikuwa bado nacheza nilikuwa nashaza panga kati za kuenya mm. I think uh, City Stars ikuja kwa sababu tukicheza Cleveland tulikuwa mm. nataka in Africa each and every city kukuwa mm. na team na yeah. jita something city ndio mm. City Stars ka come all right so sikile nilikuwa nimeretire nikirudi mm. ndio City Stars walikuwa nilikuwa nikuja nilikuwa technical director wa wa City Stars uh, youth team na Jita mm. Hope Academy. Mm. Nikikuja baada na kwa gazeti nasikia klabu imeuzwa. Wala <laughs> klabu eh, imeuzwa na eh. mimi kama vice chairman naenda sijui klabu ilikuwa imeuzwaje. Ndio maana boya sasa akiuzwaga alikuwa akitoka ga City Stars. Aha. 
Ika bidi nirudi 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 essay. Ile ah. partnership ilipokuwa City Stars na Ambassadors in Sports ikakatika. Okay. Kwa so, sababu behind our backs mm. wasewa liuza club na sisi ndio mm. tulikuwa tunatoa mafunding. Mm. Ndio ikajichuja. So okay. but uh, nilienjoy sana my career at Santos mm. na na kwanza states unajua mm. ulikuwa enda kumaliza at the age of 34 ulikuwa mm. chezeti moja uko left kwa ni ma champions so mimi mm-hmm. nasema jani yangu ilikuwa na ups and down na get, roller coaster ya yeah, roller coaster lakini pia alikuwa anapata tu alikuwa ni motivate na natoka kina panzo unaangalia unajua mm. watoka kina michael cotta na kuja national team unaona Mm. But leza kuambia na nikirudi hapo nyuma mimi niruka study 89 nikiwa na motego akiruka study ya yeah, your stadium <laughs> two years later mm. two years later nilikuwa na mark motego sasa kwa sababu nilipatia motivation because unajua mm. kitambo ulikuwa kama una una, una big name hauwezi mm. toboa bro mm. hauwezi mm. toboa true, true. Eh, kuna kuna siku bwana nimeona nime 10% kama kama tano mm jo au na au na au na au na mtu kuuliza study mm eh siku moja maana uti ya mano FC ile itoa dan shikanda kwanza je ni mtu wa mtaa na kwambia ile wacha kwa mataa kwa gate bana nililia tu sana yani nataka nataka ushikilie story ya dan shikanda hapo twende kwa u pilot hapa pilot unajua anaweza anaweza doze saa yote unajua ama ama wa kitambo au unaweza unaweza fikiria naangalia kumbe alizima niko poa niko poa Otima biatu. Ni niambie. Kabla twende kwa story ya Chipolopolo na Mwape Miti. Mm-hmm. Yes. Eh umekuwa umekuwa e, Musa Musa hapa unajua ni captain, mimi pia nime grow up nikiangalia hapo e, nikiangalia Musa. E, wewe Musa yes. anasema umekuwa inspiration kwake. Zaabe pia Amanaka mm-hmm. anasema ulikuwa mm-hmm. ulikuwa a, a great inspiration to him. Mm-hmm. Wewe nani alikuwa inspire? I think kwa ni budangu eh mm. mwanake ukiangalia jani yangu ya bole mm. budangu amekuwa very very supportive mm. kwanza unapata vijana hizo siku zetu vijana walikuwa wanacheza gamgutupu which yeah. nimepita through eh yes. lakini mzee wangu mm. alimake sure akanibaiya vitu vingine hapo copa mundial unaona hizo time kama utabaiwa copa mundial mm. yenyewe kwanza yenyewe ilikuwa ngumu sana kupata hizo vitu Mm. ndiko ngumu sana kupata hizo viatu but buda li go through his way dishana molo ali go through his way akakuja mm. kanibai hizo viatu yeah. so mimi naweza sema nilianza kucheza ball na kiatu mm. at a very tender age mm-hmm. manake unapata hiyo age nilikuwa unapata vijana wengi yenyewe unapata itseda na cheza mgutupu ama anacheza na kala ama kama si hivyo na na zile viatu za bata za kitambo zile rabas mm. kama unaweza zikumbuka zetu alada eh alafu pia kulikoga na north star So mm. unaona tu hizo ni vitu unapata kama parent wako anaweza kukubaiya kitu kama hiyo kwanza na kumotivate sana mm. kucheza bola. True. Then of course. Eh, yeah. then of course oh, walikuwa oh, oh, walikuwa na kakitu hawa. Unajua Rabas. Unajua Rabas wewe. Budaku alikuwa na kakitu. Ai. Babi huyo. Oh, alikuwa mtu hapa. <laughs> <laughs> so unapata pia mm. situation to your cricket. But manake mimi waga na hold cricket sana. Unapata mm. kwa situation ya cricket. Nilikuwa nikicheza cricket mm. but unapata Buda alikuwa fry. Manake mm. alikuwa alikuwa hizi niambia mm. but unapata yeye ukifika home unaona eh hey, unaambia Buda umetoka kucheza cricket. Mm. Yeye unaona I welcome sana, afry sana. Mm. But siku zile anasikia mmenda ball eh. Mm. Unapata na kuuliza, "Eh, hey, leo mmenda ball mmechezaje?" Mm. Yaani iko so concerned the results eh za zangara youth ama park road up hivyo. So mm. ilikuwa tu inaonyesha direction maybe Buda ana k- kitu anataka nifanye. So yeye yeye alikuwa anataka nicheze ball sana. Na unapata mm. pia Buda wangu alikuwa ni mtu anapenda ball. Unajua mm. eh kukuwa na team. Kukuwa na team si kitu rahisi eh. Mm. Kuna team tu na run team si kitu rahisi. Yeah. Buda alikuwa anaifanya. So unapata yeye ni mtu alikuwa anapenda ball. So naweza sema ni inspire sana sana sana. Mm. Mimi kucheza ball. Mm. Oteshe. Naam. Kuna jamaa wangu fulani yuko ana watch kutoka Qatar anaitwa Joel Omino anasema tell Musa that of all captains I've watched wear the armband for Harambe Stars he is the captain of captains fine lad level headed and committed to the game and his role of protecting the keeper So you I think ni compliments uh, thanks sir thanks sir usilie buda unaweza anza kulia hapa 
Bravo na jua ndio maana nilikuwa na totero. Sikizi nimetuliza tu yaani. Unajua? Kwanza anaweza kuambia yaani. Unajua Bravo sasa zingine una laga watu wanafanya vitu. Wao umetuliza tu. Atafikia tu story unasikia. Bram, maybe tutaongea jia 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 team za Rambi Stars eh zile tumekuwa eh. Lakini the moment niliona Musa eh. Because mimi nilimuona kwanza kicheza shule then akakuja akatujoin eh akani join Tasca na hata akani join Kenya Brewers nilijeucha aliyetoka captain because mm-hmm. captain unamuona tu leadership Oye, captain, captain enye Musa na leadership qualities zingine yenyewe si wachezaji wengi wako nazo after he's always ready to learn mm-hmm. unapata hizo time nikicheza nikicheza ball na yeye especially mm-hmm. tukikuwa tuki partners hapo central defense mm-hmm. enye kitu yote nilikuwa naambia Musa maana yake mimi ndio nilikuwa captain hiyo time eh Mm. Kitu yote nilikuwa namwambia yenyewe alikuwa anasikia. So, naweza sema I was also lucky kucheza na mtu kama Musa kwa central defense ama kwa defense. Turudi kwake. Oteshe. Yes. Naam, mimi najua Musa, Musa ni Musa mimi mpiga any time you come through. So, hiyo goes without saying. Kuna jamaa hapa amenitumia vitu a, siri, a sequence of events. Nataka ku take mm-hmm. through and then kama uko na anything unaweza add, add on it. Anasema do you know Musa is the first player to score at the new Green Point Stadium in Cape Town after it was built. Hiyo ni point ya kwanza. Yeah, Unataka kusema kitu ama niendelee? Ukweli. Aya <laughs> anasema jazi yake Santos number 2 na hao yake ilikuwa 222 Main Road Newlands House number 2. Ukweli? <laughs> anasema what was the meaning of number 2? Ju watoi pia ni wawili. Then <laughs> ama kuna mwingine then anasema <laughs> he was famously called Musa Muso after ile gari and the owner of Kilimanjaro Hiyo ni ukweli? Ni ukweli. So hebu tupeleke kwa jani yako one kabla tuende kwa jani yako SA because uh, I think you it take a while kidogo so kabla tuende kwa jani yako ya SA this is something that I wanted to confirm from you here just a minute kipo go to hapa budo sio go tu uko na mimi mm, kuna kitu nataka tu confirm hapa because ime, ime, ime come up as a, as a pointer sitiko rada sio uko poa tuko poa hamzo tunaanza na wewe iki kosi unaikumbuka okay wow unaikumbuka sana <laughs> naona hapo george sungu na mbona mlikuwa mavaka gore nafanya hiyo arambe kala za arambe ni green eh? na ukiangalia na introduce players hapo next player na introduce ni Musa and then after Musa ni Michael Koth yeah. and then kuna Polo Cheng Kunde then kuna Sunguti yeah. Musa uchali mrefu akucheza sana na sisi nimemsahau lakini alikuwa alikuwa goal uni jare uni jare and then wangu 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 huyo mwingine mwisho huyo mwingine mwisho ni Tom alafu Otamax anamalizia. Eh. Yeah. Nataka kumbusha wewe ni game gani? Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Wow. Kwa game gani? I think hiyo game tulicheza huko Conakry. Ili kwa Conakry? Yeah, yeah Sungu yeah. alichangua mbaya sana. Aligeuzwa. Unachoma Musa. Musa unachoma. Sawa. Unachoma. Sema kama alipakwa ni pakwa Buda. Kula kwa 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 Bram, eh, bram. Eh, eh. Unacheki oje hii game? Eh. Kama naweza kukumbuka vipoa sana, ndio national team ilikuja, eh. Fabisha kai change. Oh. Kama si mm-hmm. wrong. Mm-hmm. Eh. Hii, mm-hmm. Na hii ndio tukabaki mimi yo Tamax. Eh, hii sasa ndio mayankio wa kikam sasa. Wow. Hapa hivi naona Musa iko karibu yangu and then kuna Vincent kwa Rula. Uh-huh. And then Eriko, Tamax iko katikati. Eriko, Eriko bado ni bro wa Musa sio? Eh ya. Hapo juu wale wale wanasimama, alafu kuna after Otamax kuna Alan Odiambo. Uh-huh. Alafu kuna Udu Kolokolo, very very good <laughs> defender. Uh-huh. Alafu squatting hapo kuna naona Tom Tom Juma. Gaza. Alafu Alan Odiambo. Uh-huh. Alafu Toma... ni, Nika uh, no. uh-huh. okay, Alafu yeah. kuna eh, alafu kuna Anthony Luanga. Hii ilikuwa ni nyao. Musa hii ilikuwa ni nyao stadium na nakumbuka nafikiri nafikiri pia tulikuwa tunacheza na same gini kama sijakosea Pamza tuwezi pata hii jazi tutengeze replica tumangie Hii jazi niko nayo lakini kwa picha <laughs> Hii jazi Bram Bram Hizi hey, hey. zile majazi majazi ziko zatoka kwa Olympic 
Eh, ukiangalia ilikuwa ni Nike. Eh. Za zilikuwa za under 23, alafu socks na zilikuwa za Adidas. Eh. So ilikuwa ni kila time lazima tutubai uni, tulikuwa tuna sponsor. Mm. Hardship. Coaches. Wow. Hapa hivi ni kwa India. Eh. Hapa hivi ni kwa India nafikiri ni 27 years old. Eh. Yeah. Alafu si ati na sign check ka eh, <laughs> Bram eh. Yeah. Yeah. Na sign na sign na auto. Eh. Yeah. So nipit na sign auto, na sign auto. Ati auto. <laughs> mm. Una una picha baka signature. Eh, alafu ah, ah, Bram Bram, um, Bram Eh bro uh, na chari sana hii picha eh. maana kando yangu hapa hivi mm. ni Peter Mololo na hii Bram mm. ilikuwa under 21 hii mm. under 21 is the one of the best team eh nisha 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 ilikuwa assembled coach ulikuwa under 21 hapa kweli ama ulikuwa under 27 no no hii ilikuwa under 21 okay. na ilikuwa ilikuwa early 90 alright alafu uni maremu ni uni full back eh? Mm. Uya meva black huyo katikati yango alafu fa oni uh, uh, Tomo Diambo striker mm. mm-hmm. alafu nyuma kabisa kuna chali moja ni tochawe mweusi alafu hapo katikati nyuma na track ya red huyo eh. ni ni Odwar Francis Odwar mm. alafu left yake ni Alan Odiambo huyo huyo amefichwa kidogo ni Oluoche okay eh hapa hii ni ukipiga kick, kickback sio? Ya hapa hivi wow hapa ni nikiwa East Bengal. Umesema wow. Lakini kama ndio nime nimeenda kama assistant coach eh. Mm-hmm. Mm. Nafikiri tulikuwa kwa show fulani hapo. Hapo umetulia na maboys tu mtaa huko. Eh hapa tulikuwa tumeenda promotion. Mbona ni macho I sexy sexy hivi coaches? Nilikuwa nime miss home, nilikuwa nime miss home. <laughs> So hapo uh, hapo hapo na email tipia siwezi sahau nilikuwa nilikuwa assistant coach eh mm. na tulikuwa tumeshinda rivals wetu Monbagan 41 mm. wacha nikwambie uh, Bram eh mm. game ya East Bengal na Monbagan wa gani fireworks mm. the biggest derby na sasa sema one of the biggest derbies kwa Asia mm. unapata East Derby ni to Salt Lake East Derby ubebaga eh East Derby ubebaga 100 130 na wewe na jaa East Bengal wakicheza hata wakati niko nacheza bole mm. huko ilikuwa ina jaa na utapata mm. wengine wako nyuma so hapa ni mimi assistant coach East Bengal hii picha <laughs> wewe huko kwa hii picha hii ni picha mimi niko hapa kwa hii picha nimekabila nime shati kuna mnayo mtiti kuna yes. ojwanga hapo nyuma melo achache eh, melo Hmm. Hapa wewe ndio ulikuwa coach wetu pale Gor na I think tutakuja kwa hii picha baadaye kwa short exactly. kiendelea because exactly. pia wewe umeni 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 menta sana kwa kwa career mine though it, it was hmm. a bit short but tutarudi hmm. kwa picha baadaye. Mhm. Wow, hapa ni kwa task. Hmm? Unaona hapa ni kwa task eh? hmm. lakini tulikuwa tuna train TZ Dar es Salaam. Tulikuwa tumeenda tulikuwa tumeenda championship. Right. Mhm pa hey, tension ilikuwa nakuwa hapo in fact nilikuwa eh, post match analysis eh mm-hmm. na nige mtuli nige mtuli shinda, na nakumbuka Karo ndiye alikuwa anachukua hiyo post match analysis Karo moja Karo Radul mmoja tu all right mhm buda hapo ilikuwa nani yako ni hapo vile nilikuwa nasoma game mm. Na ilikuwa ni Poster Rangers. <laughs> eh nafikiri nafikiri vitu zilikuwa ziwaki vile nataka eh. Ukiona yeah. nimechukua gai tuwezi kuna vile vitu waziwaki vile nataka. Kamechacha. Eh kamechacha. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Wow. Ap- <laughs> Unazipita? Turudi kwa hii. Hii ni same na hiyo ingine so twende kwa hiyo. Hapa ni kwa ni relax. Okay. Hii ni KCB ni kwa assistant coach au owner kwa head coach. Mm. na ilikuwa nafikiri ni break maybe mtu ana injury so nilikuwa na pass message au una ameniambia ni pass message na maybe kitu naona mm. so niko naongea na mchezaji wangu hapa naona ni kish mm. na wenzake na hapa hii ilikuwa inaendelea coaches bana eh hii ni style gani dombolo dombolo unaona hii ball wa ni funny yeah. but nilikuwa najua nini nafanya maana ilikuwa tulikuwa tunacheza na um home boys Mm. na unapata walipata throw na hii throw ilikuwa karibu na bench eh mm. uplea uplea na long throw sana lakini ukiangalia mm. organization ya defense yetu haikuwa mbaya 
haikuwa mzuri so nilikuwa na jaribu kudile uti huyu msiasi urushe ball so ndio unaona hii picha ilikuwa hapa alafu pia tulikuwa tuna lead game <laughs> eh hey, eh hey, hey. Oh So ajabu <laughs> Rangers <laughs> this team. Si ni game ya Nigeria tu. Eh iki kosi ya 97 hapo ndio kwa kwamba ile game kwa tumecheza. Mm. Fabish ali come the late and yet is is my mentor alikuwa mm. Buda. Mm. Na afikiria ile game kwa mtaka kukuambia mm. alipochuja wakina Pamzo, wakina Motego kulikuwa mm. na a big a big big issue. Mm. Kwa sababu hakuna bila za chuja kina Francis Tony Luanga alafu akachukua tu wachezaji wachache. Mm. Lakini like, angalia kitu pole alikuwa amefanya Mm-hmm. Una Nike Kosi kona Michael Koth. Yeah. Unaona? Wakina mm-hmm. Cantona walitokea from nowhere. Mm-hmm. The late uh, Lichuku. Unaona? Mm-hmm. Saif Mutie. Yeah. I think ni ile structure alikuwa anataka ku, ku, ku change. Angalia ni Danko yuko mchumani. Mm-hmm. Na ukiangalia the opposite team tulikuwa mm-hmm. na watu wengine tu sugu. But nikitaka tu kuangalia Kenya, mm-hmm. I think ilikuwa ni tulikuwa tuna stick ku kuangalia kama tunaweza change mtu kama Samuel Molo mm-hmm. because atakuwa na good structure. Mm. Unaona? Mm. Kulikuwa tu ni ah national team kito unajua ah namba Busola atakuwa hapo, Motego atakuwa hapo, unajua? In, in fact Bram eh mm. tukiona time eh yeah tuonge hiyo because it's very very important eh transition your okay. ball. Mm. Let me then rush through the photos so that we ca- we come to the transition of uh, of football. Mm. Otesha hapa I think ni Afcon. Hapo ni Afcon I think uh, for me first of all kuchezia ku represent Kenya kwanza Afcon. Nafikiri hii game before hata niende Afcon Mm. Game yangu ya mwisho ilikuwa ni retire. Mm. Then wakipiga bao moja wakevada hapo nyayo Kasarani. Kasarani. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Na as a, as, unyeo, as, a, as a player mimi nilikuwa mm. nasema unajua kama unacheza cup of nation kuna wale wenyewe mm. wakucheza ukicheza cup of nation unajua kama ndio world cup ya Africa. Yeah. Mm. So mm. na as much as you can at least ukicheza kwa tayari cup of nation at least kwako tu pale. So mm. represent Kenya mm. yeye tulikuwa na very young players at that time. Mm. to make some silly mistakes zile tunafanya kutoka that time back today mm. Mm. tunafanya the same same unaona yeah. so unapata tunajiuliza gatu tulilan nini from the cup of national tulikuwa 204 mm. hadi sasa yeah mm. mlikuwa na yeah. team pia nzito nzito kwa hiyo group yenu i think your time pia senegal walikuwa walikuwa na testa watu uh, kwa continent na pia uh, kwa world mlipata na ma striker kina diof kina kamara walikukimbiza hata tulikuwa na challenges mob na kiangalia cup of nation tulipoingia kwanza mm. tulikuwa tukola, tulikuwa na Mali mm. tulikuwa na Senegal mm. and then tulikuwa na Burkina Faso una yeah. get mm. na ukiangalia kama 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 Senegal unacheki kama kulikuwa na Diof Diof at that time alikuwa anapiga Liverpool unajua yeah. yeah. team mtu alikuwa anacheza opera ile tu kabisa alikuwa ni Mike mm. a top team yeah. unaona na mimi na Santos eh wakina Tom Juma alikuwa anacheza local teams si mm. team kubwa kubwa lakini Sweden kulikuwa mm. na ake umeona mm. mm. so tulikuwa tuna tulilan tuna, tuna, tuna the hard way unaona hiyo mm. mm. yeye kitu tunakuja kuangalia hata zile ball tulikuwa tunafungwa mm. sio wakati na pro act kwa ball yeah. yetu ya Kenya mm. unaona by the mm. time tukija ku realize nini tunafanya mm. ukiangalia uangalize mabao zote tulikuwa tunafungwa ilikuwa ni difficult yeah. so inakuja again to back back to our structure pale chini unaona mm. do tumefika cup of nation bado tuja click bado tuko na injuries unaona mm. 
lakini Diof anakuja kwanza na bodyguards kama watu watatu. Wao namkatia kwanza alikuwa nakata gazeti na msupport. <laughs> Kila salif diao, huyu ni salif diao kwanza. Eh, eh bonus kwanza ni 10 dollars. Unaona? Unaona piga cup of nation. Nini na kumotivate? Unaona? Mm. Hapa ni I think this juzi naona kina Zwang Fode ini squad ya baadaye kidogo. Kabuka ngala kina Fode, akina Alan walikuwa nakuja in. Nilikuwa tuna kama kama leader because I think here ni Anton Hey. I think you the coach. Niliporudi sasa home nikiona nakumbuka mind nilikuwa nimeretire alafu nikarudi. Na one of the things Anton Hey alikuwa anataka, alikuwa anataka at least ni come into coaching. Unaona lakini leta pale yes alikuwa anajua speed imeishia ama whatever lakini alikuwa jele experience niko nayo naweza mm. kama na share na wachezaji wangu because alikuwa shana leadership kwangu mm. akana ucha leza kuwa coach umeona mm. so mm. another german comes in anaona kuna something uko na wewe anakurusha back ndio tunaenda Nigeria zile mambo za sasa scandals zikaanza kutokeaga unaona mm. tucheza abuja mm. but again nimecheza na crop ya wachezaji wale tungewa push tu tungewa value more wangeenda mm. far sana yeah mm-hmm. yo bado ni hapa sasa tumeingia south Yeah, I, South naweza kuambia nje Santos nilipoingia Santos naweza sema na nakaa na hapa kwanza hivi nikisema kuna Elias Makori kuna brother yangu Barack Kouma mm. lakini kwanza Elias Makori alinipatia mm. opportunity mm. alinipatia opportunity mtu alikuwa anijui mm. na naenda mali weather ni different yeah. unafika hivi kwanza unaulizwa eh hey, wewe ni mkenya atujui ona goal tunajua tu kinyato watoka Gambio Mm, mm. So kwanza lugha ndio changamoto, unaona? Mm, lugha mm. changamoto, mm. style of play ni different, kuna baridi mm. ka, so ujui chochote. Yeah. Unaona? Yeah. Lakini mimi nilianga nilikuwa nimeangalia mali nimetoka, nikasema mm. sitarudi home. Mm. Santos hapo pia, at that time unapata pia nilikuwa mpaka na sponsor, nilikuwa na sponsor wa Ghana Umbro, unaona? So oh, ulikuwa mpaka na sponsor, individual sponsor. Eh, yeah, nilikuwa na individual sponsor, hiyo wow. Umbro nilikuwa natumia Ghana Umbro. At least wow. nilimeka mark ilikuwa ni one season hmm. after yani lazima tu adapt the big challenge ile tunapata kama players wetu tunapata ni ku adapt as quickly as possible wanataka hmm. kucheza bado style yako umeona hmm. hmm. so nilipofika San, Santos Cape Town wote wanapigaga English football hmm. so inabidi lazima ni change as quickly as possible ni adapt kwa their system hmm. and, and i think ilikuwa one of my key ku survive yeah. kwa hiyo club yeah yeah ehe uh-huh. uko bado ni south Wow. Hiyo sasa hiyo hiyo picha nyingine imepita kwanza. Eh. Ni sasa hiyo. Ni ile sasa eh ni ile sasa ulikuwa na mbwa ile siku nilifunga bao ya kwanza. Mimi ndio nilikuwa mtu wa first kufunga bao kwa hiyo study. Right. I think hapa tulipigaga Ajax. Mm. Na hiyo siku mimi nilifunga nilifunga bao ya kwanza kwa hiyo study. Nice. Wind coach Bubi, mm. ni technical director, hata juzi tulikuwa na online ya workshop ya coaching mm. na makochezo wa kutoka South. At least ni a mentor pia on the other side. Mm nimelala a lot from him yeah yeah mhm hapo again after 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 game au ni wa Kenya una check ni kwa natumia products zingine za jitahabo life at least mm. after game unapata nini una source je pengine mtaani umetaka mtu amecheza game after mm. game hakuna hakuna kitu hata anachukua ya kukula ya kumwongezea pengine unajua juma toka umesweat mm. unajua product gani unatumia si mm. kama Santos ilikuwa ziko hapo again pia hapo nilikuwa na shop yangu na jitahabo life mm. at least unakula vizuri unacheza vipoa whatever una, una put pia in mm. itakupatia nini watoa nje unaona mm. yeah eh uh, utatuambia pia baadaye uh, role yako pale ambaye at some point pia i think ulikuwa kwa technical bench pia so utatupeleka na rada pia hapa ilikuwa yeah, ni watu. i think hapa ni ujeri niko na organization moja jita kick off to hope mm-hmm. tulikuwa tumetembelea our sponsors iko stuttgart Mm-hmm. So I think as a, as a, the founder the CEO of Kiko to Hope mm-hmm. you know one of my sponsor anaitwa mm-hmm. Herbert mm-hmm. Gasbauer coach mm-hmm. Amisi ni mkenya pia juzi mm-hmm. tulikuwa na yeye Germany tukifanya hiyo grassroots uh, UEFA mm-hmm. so at least pia organization tunapeleka pia watu hizo ma, ma courses mm-hmm. but uh, nimekuwa so close na wa Germans mm-hmm. dosi wangu anatoka Germany anaitwa Mark Gasbauer wewe ni budake So every year mm. tunaendaga kucheki tunapeleka pia some courses tunaangalia nini tunazafanya wanafanya mm. nini si tunafanya nini na mm. mm. so kick off to hope ile nje Germany so tuko na relationship now so tulienda kutembea u Germany at least tuone nini nafanyika at least to implement kwa academy yetu pia ishbin ishbin morgan ishbin morgan hapa ni 
hapa ni samiti eh wewe unaona nilikuwa mnono joy time haya kabisa sahihi sahihi nilikuwa muslim na una pia fande hapo afande pia kweli hapo na manyole yake died mm bro mimi nataka kusema i think this is part of unajua sometimes mimi kukuja kwanza kwa isa misi ni through wewe but the most important thing unajua nikicheza ball au my fans walikuwa behind walikuwa walali unajua Kenya inacheza kwanza kama buda yako kwanza ni mtu na respect sana unajua afande kwa hapo so i think it was part of giving back to the community mmekona mrani support Mm. Watch and come you at least you are to thank you. Now mm. whatever you are doing back at home, unajua mm. si lazima uishi home. But mm. remember wewe umezaliwa na watu wa community, wamekulela, wamekulea ukafika mali umefika. Mm. So we just need to go and see kama tunaweza patia watu wengine hope waende mm. to another level. Mimi kutoka hiyo tournament, mm. nafikiri wale wale pass nilipatia wanga. Pasiani, Musa alisikia. Ay, 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 how did you, how, did you, how did you feel playing in the same field with me? Haya ulikuwa nasikiaje kucheza na mimi kwa game. Bram, sasa lakini Bram, yani wewe wewe sikiaje tu kwa closer na mimi yani kwanza mnasema tu ati ati huyo Charlie huyo midfielder huyo. Bila noma, wewe yani hata story yako mi siwezi kuambia asante saa hii but hiyo ni kitu I think tuliongea so wacha tutaongea off off the camera but mimi na join time na ku need haujai niangusha buda nasema hiyo i think ni mmejo papazi yangu i think for me zina the matter sijali because mimi nafanya tu kazi ya god so mm. i'm there i'm ready to support uh, kenyan football kupatia mtu hope in a any way naweza mm. fanya lisa yeah. li, li, eh, kuna huyo de mameka hapo nyuma inaitwa Cynthia Lisa anasema ulimchafua na masamosa na masjui man zile vitu zikuwa zinauzo huko nyuma unajua nyinyi mlikuwa mmeka vvip so anasema ulimchafua sana huko na hizo maboiro <laughs> <laughs> Unde <laughs> 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 slippers. Ah uh, unde uh, mameka hapo nyuma. Watu wazi anakuwa slippers. Sio slippers. Watu wanavua tu slippers. Didi didi. Lazima uangalie mtoka wapi unaenda wapi. Watu wanakala slippers alafu basi. Potesha alafu baadaye utatupeleka rada historia ya Kikofop. Kuna shughuli fulani ulikuwa unafanya eh. pia ya kufeed mafamilia naona mtu wangu hapa Timothy Umeme Umeme pia tumecheza naye bola hapo ziwa sana tumecheza naye pia mm-hmm. pedico so tutapeleka pia na rada e, pale yeah. Dr Craft pia kuna mambo mob sana unafanya hapo na watu hui so pia hizo pia utatuonyesha alafu kuna hiyo Nise... eh utakusema kitu kapi unajua siwezi kuzuia ndani ni sawa sawa naweza sema tu at least naweza ongea sasa ama baadaye unasema baadaye tutaacha tu tackle baadaye au ushasema Eh, kuna jamaa anaitwa Fakir Shah, Sami Omolo, yani akuamini na kuleta kwa shoma zi. <laughs> Anasema the footballer, did you know in Kolkata, West Bengal, India, lot of fans still now for Omolo. Yani ameandika ki, 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 ki. Eh, au au hujafunja kiasi. Eh, <laughs> <laughs> Bravo ni fans wangu kule. Mm. Eh, so hiyo I think ni ma, ni mabonga points hapo Pamzo. And then Pamzo I think kuna kitu nilikuwa nataka kugusia hiyo eh, story ya transition ya coaching na kupatia time pia yeah. u, u, uh, because okay. coaching. Safi, uh, because hapa kuna kuna figures zingine hapa zenye zimenisikia kidogo the most followed mm. African clubs on social media kuna Al Ahli 27 million Zamalek 12 million Raja Casablanca 6 million Keza Chiefs uh, 5 million Orlando Pirates 4 million Pyramids FC 3 million Wydad 2.2 Simba hii ni Simba ya TZ by the way hapa hakuna kitu kama gor hakuna kitu kama fc yani hiyo mm-hmm. ni si vitu tutamaliza lini but is it the most followed african teams on social media mm-hmm. watu wengi wachukulia ng social media serious okay, uh, okay. kuna session kuna session moja nataka kufanya next week ya branding and marketing i think itakuwa fit sana kama watu wata tune in tawapatia tarehe na, na the guests na the speakers so tumemaliza hapo mm-hmm. pamzo There's yes. something you wanted to tell us. Yeah, Bram, kuna kitu yeah. nataka kukuambia mm. na maybe hata wadau eh. Mm. Uh, wanasema hivi. Kuna time Kenya tungechukua tungechukua Afcon. Mm. One was in 1990 mm. na second imekuwa 2000. Mm. Kwa, zini, kwa sababu gani nasema hivi Bram? Maana mm. ukiangalia Kenya kwanza mm. enye kuna talent. Yes, no doubt. Course. Ukianza tangu za kina kadenge mm. kuja kina unaona okay, wanyama buda wanyama 
mm. kwa kuja mpaka kina mulamba mm-hmm. kumbe kwa na talent yani Kenya tumekuwa tuna short ya talent yeah. na ukiangalia kulikuwa na 1990s na, naanza na 90 90 kulikuwa na coach mmoja alikuwa anaitwa Gary Saura mm-hmm. Gary Saura mm-hmm. alikuwa na handle national team mm-hmm. na at the same time alikuwa na handle under 21 mm-hmm. na huko coach alikuja mm-hmm. akafanya scouting noma sana Mm-hmm. scouting noma sana ile mimi naweza sema hiyo kitu tuangusha kidogo mm-hmm. ifact tu chali alienda Kenya nzima kutafuta players mm-hmm. na scouting yake alikuja ka identify very very good players wale walokuja wakakuja kacheza DK pamoja mm-hmm. na kwa hiyo scouting yake mm-hmm. unapata nilikuwa ndani mm-hmm. Francis Oduora alikuwa ndani kila alitoboa kila alikuwa ndani mm-hmm. Vincent Kwarula alikuwa ndani Mm-hmm. Nakumbuka pia Made alikuwa ndani. Mm-hmm. Then Peter Mololo pia alikuwa ndani. Mm-hmm. Kulikuwa na chali moja alikuwa anaitwa Terry Onyanga alikuwa ndani. In fact, si usema Made naona mbio, mm-hmm. lakini ni Uteri alikuwa na speed. Uteri mm-hmm. alikuwa na burst. Mm-hmm. Then kwa squad bado kulikuwa na Alan Odhiambo na kulikuwa na Tom Odhiambo. Mm-hmm. Afu pia kulikuwa na William Inganga. Sijui kama unaweza kumbuka William Inganga. Kumbuka William Inganga yeah. Kwa mzuri sana FC. Mm-hmm. Then unapata hii time eh. Mm-hmm. Hii team ilikuja tukacheza pamoja sana hii 90 yote mpaka tuseme 90 uh, 1998 mm. lakini unapata kitu ilikuwa inatoka pamoja Brame eh? yeah. unapata kila every year unapata mm. tulikuwa na very competitive game mm-hmm. every year from 1990 tulikuwa na very competitive game every mm. year mm. na ni countries kubwa kubwa so unapata hii mm. team yenyewe ilikuja ikakuwa na very good experience but mm. in between mm. unapata kwa hii under 21 Mhm. Maraki Saura alikuja kama intense sana hii team. Mm-hmm. But we maintain kuna kulikuwa na watu wanakuja nyuma yetu. Kulikuwa right. na Musa, mm-hmm. kulikuwa na Tojo, mm-hmm. then nakumbuka pia kulikuwa na Onyiso. Ana watu walikuja wakaje the senior team. Yes. Then hapo hivyo pia tulipata players wengine. Kwa hiyo senior team. Mhm. Maraki nakumbuka Michael Kota alikuwa pale, Botego alikuwa pale. Mm-hmm. Shoto pia alikuwa pale hivyo. So this was a very complete team. Lakini mm-hmm. unapata kina Shoto alikuja wakatoka, senior mm-hmm. players tukabaki na mtu kama Mike peke yake. Mm-hmm. Na mtu kama Mutego peke yake na hata Sami Shuli. Mm-hmm. So motivation motivation ya team ilikuwa tulikuwa tunajua tutakuwa tuna tuna host cup of nations. Mm-hmm. Cup of nations ilikuwa supposed to hosted in Kenya 96. Mm-hmm. 96. Mm-hmm. Na so tulikuwa motivated manake unapata before that 90s unapata Goro amechukua Mandela Cup unapata 90s bado Harambee Stars eh Harambee mm. Stars 90s mm. eh, all african games hapa na Nairobi mm. walifungwa tu finali na Egypt peke yake alright lakini ni game ilikuwa ngumu sana mm. so unapata sisi tulikuwa tunajua hata Musa alikuwa hapo eh sisi tulikuwa tunajua enye eh, tutakuwa tuna host cup of nations 96 mm. na most of it ilikuwa inakuja itakuwa ina change life ya players wengi. Mm. Maana unapata players wengi walikuwa locally. Mm. Walikuwa local based players. I think mm. Motego tu na Mike ndio nafikiri walikuwa Oman. Mm. But the rest unapata tulikuwa tulikuwa ni local players na unapata team zetu zilikuwa zinafanya poa sana. Maana yeah. Tasca uh, Kenya Breweries your time ilikuwa inafanya mm. poa sana. Maana mm. tulikuwa tunacheza tulikuwa tunaenda baka Champions League. Unakumbuka mm. tukicheza na Motema Pembe. Mm-hmm. Na most of those players yenye wengi walikuwa mm-hmm. hii national team. Then unapata pia tulikuwa na majuniors wa okay, Tom Juma, Musa pia ame join, watu yeah. nimesema. Yeah. So tulikuwa tunajua yenyewe tutakuwa tuna host hii 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 tournament. Alright. Afcon. Na Bram si mm-hmm. na wadanganya because mimi nilikuwa na hiyo team sana. Na right. time nilikuwa captain. Mm. Let me tell you na hiyo motivation tulikuwa tume, tumeona hizo t- mm-hmm. au players wengine warambua wamefanya. Mm. Enye kama tunge host mm. cup of nations mm. niko sure hiyo team ingefika finali na tungechukua cup of nations mm. that's what i'm very very sure mm-hmm. lakini unaona Kenya mm. vile Kenya huwa atukuweza host cup of nation hiyo time maana mm. kwanza tukua na infrastructure mm-hmm. ili to knock out then kulikuwa na politics maana unapata nafikiri Jobo Mino ndiye alikuwa chairman hiyo time mm-hmm. and then one more alikuwa hapo hivyo so hiyo time ndio wakati mm. Uh, multi party ilikuwa inaingia mm. so ilikuwa hard sana yenyewe to host cup of nations mm-hmm. so that is one moment yenyewe mm. tuli tupasana kama Kenya 
kushinda cup of nations because me am very tumechukua afcon afcon then unapata hii kerende yote ilikuja wengi tukaachana late late 90s tukaachana mm. then 2000 unapata timu ikakuja kachimbi mm. na bram ebu nisikie watu sana niko niko na hii team, team ilipo change yeah because ni team inge chukua cup of nations hii right. team ilipo change mm. tulikuja tukakuwa na golden generation mm. tulikuja tukakuwa na golden generation yeah hii golden generation uh-huh. unapata onyiso alikuwa mchumani yes. na unapata arnold alikuwa mchumani origi yeah. hebu imagine tayari uko na mm. two top keepers kabisa kwa timu yako Mm. Then e golden generation Musa na Waweru walikuwa ndani kama defenders. Mm. Jojo. Thierry Musa mm. experience is India is the captain is the leader. Mm. Thierry there is a very good base iko kwa hiyo team. Mm. Then e team kwa midfield mm. e team kulikuwa na Mariga. Uh-huh. E team golden generation ilikuwa na Mugubi. Mano. Golden gen- yeah. Golden generation ilikuwa na Malo uh-huh. Golden generation ilikuwa na Pass Master na Uyako. Tito ilikuwa Uyako. Tito uh-huh. Na usisahau hii team kulikuwa na Oyombe Apache Hii team imagine hii uh-huh. golden generation uh-huh. ilikuwa na John Mururi Mururi Mo Mo uh-huh. Iti hii golden generation ilikuwa na wachezaji wote Then baada tujasema Dennis Oliech The Menace Bram e golden generation your time mm. nani alikuwa coach e golden generation your time ghost mulende alikuwa coach kapweps but e golden generation yetu ili fail mm. na ili fail si kwa sababu wachezaji si wazuri just like the other generations zile sisi mm. kilikuwa pia nazo e golden generation ili fail kwa sababu ya system mm. because mimi na believe e team mm. Mm. and it's wange chukua cup of nations na wange qualify world cup mm. but awange weza hata qualify world cup mm-hmm. manake ya system mm. na the way frax, eh, eh, infrastructure yetu iko yeah. let me tell you unaona kwa hii team nimechaja to bram yeah. hii team kama tungekuwa na strong youth yeah. development hii team wanze under 13 right wakitoka under 13 wande under 17 wako pamoja right from there wa, wa in the under 21 baka under 23 together mpaka wa in the senior team right any team ngo ko na sumbwa any team kwa continent but i think i think there is a kana i think there is a kana because mm. of infrastructure and these are the things yenyewe mm. kama governor federation lazima tuangalie because hakuna shortcut unaona kama juzi uh, eh uh, musa ikuna ta ta, musa eh okay kidogo tu okay. nikimaliza point yangu sawa coaches tulikuwa cup of nations juzi mm. si ndio mm. tulikuwa cup of nations mm. but tunasema mm. it was true luck mm. that we end up cup of nations mm. si leon wangekuwa atungeenda maybe tunge qualify ama tungeenda but mimi sitaki Kenya tufike situation ya yenyewe tunabahatisha because mm. atujui kama tena after mm. another 15 years to qualify Mm, mm, mm. If we have structures then mm. arambe inafaga after every two years mm. tuna kuli ku fight cup of nation where that to in the same group na Nigeria na to in the same Ivory group Coast. na, Mor- na Morocco my Ivory Coast we yeah. have to qualify manake youth strat, uh, youth, youth develop, football development ebu angalia kwa nini wa kina Ivory Coast wagaona qualify ebu angalia situation na nakupatia good example angalia wa kina yeye Toure true Angalia kina Didier Zakora. Mm-hmm. Angalia kina Drogba. Yeah. Angalia hawa watu wote wamekuwa kwa youth structure pamoja under 13. Mm-hmm. Asek Mimosa mpaka wakakuja kwa kwa senior team. Mm-hmm. Hakuna vile watabahatisha qualify. So that is the that is the way sisi tunafakufanya. Wewe hata angalia Germany wakichukua waki 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 World Cup hapo mafike World Cup. Unaangalia wakina Ozil, wakina Cruz, wakina Rose, wakina eh ukipawa Noya wote wamekuwa under 13 pamoja waki mm. grow mm. kwa nini wasichukue world cup so mm. tulikuwa na opportunity kubwa sana mm. especially the e team e golden generation kuchukua 
kukulify World Cup ama kuchukua Cup of Nations. Mm. But I kuweze kana. So mimi yenyewe mimi waga so bitter because hii ilikuwa talent just like any uh, all other Arabic stars zimekuwa hapo. Musa Musa tukuje yeah. eh, I think Pamzo hapo imebidi afunguke na I think he has very valid points na I think unataka kuongeza kitu wacha tukusikize lazima tu niongeze lazima mm. tu niongeze mm. I, i think one of the things uh, tume kwanza mm. Kenya tunaweza sema tu as, as, as a whole mm. uh, we are not valuing our players both mm. in women and into men mm. una get mm. kwa sababu tungekuwa tunavali hao say mm. first of all mm. what tungekuwa tunaenda mbali sana vile pamoja anasema mm. okay tukiongea kuhusu mambo ya structure i think that is one of the problem ile Kenya tuko mm. first Okay kuna federation si ndio mm. So how many how many clubs how many, how many academies mm-hmm. they are affiliated to the federation because lazima 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 kwa kuna mtu anatuchunga si ndio mm. ndio ndio kwanza anasema huyu mtu yeye alikuwa 30 years mm. utaenda kumtafuta alikuwa anachezea timu gani mm. sawa mm. so kwanza kama sasa sisi na ile the body iko pale atutaingia yeah. nao mm. u- regardless of whoever comes in mm. una get mm. unaona what can we do panza mecheza nje nje so many people wamecheza nje unaona mm. juzi kumekuwa na team ya under 50 imeleta kasheshe hivi vile 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 si ndio mm. so tunaweza kusema structure tu tanzia api kama ni under 13 pia system yetu ya education i allow that Mm. But, kuna kuna fan hapa kuna mtu hapa anasema Ustad Sheikh kuna Ustad Sheikh ana ameleta point hapa ambayo nataka kuwauliza nayo. Hizi ideas new share na federation. Do you at- so let me tell you bra bra mata kabla uendelee I'll ask that. You know? Mm. We have so many ideas especially former players vile tu Musa amesema na wale mm. wacheza hii but mm. are we accommodated? That is the thing. Are we accommodated? Bra mimi sita mm. force Mm. ati nataka kushare ID yangu na mtu and mm. yet is not ready to listen. Mm. I can't do that because pia mimi hata Musa he has his own pride. Mm. Kama mtu amekuwa captain wa Rambi Stars kama mtu amechezea Rambi Stars. In fact But, Europe waga hao mm. ndio wanakimbilia former players. Wakoje waambie ni tutafanya nini hapa? Yes. Mimi niko na swali moja. Na mko yes, hapa, wewe uko hapa, Otesha yuko hapa. Mimi I, I think if there's someone I hold with so much respect kwa game it's Musa Otieno. Musa uki, uki, uki jina yako ikitajwa mali yoyote yani waina kila antenna zinasimama. Musa, why don't you go for the top seat? Mbona haujawahi kuja ukasema mimi sasa nataka ku change game and the only way I can change the game is by being in the in, in, in the system. Na tutaku support. I, 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 so Bram neza neza kuambia one thing. First of all let's say thanks to all my supporters, thanks to all those people who have believed on mimi kukuwa on the hot seat kule juu ku change Kenyan football. But mimi nataka kujiuliza one thing Bram. Una get? Nimekuambaka kwa national team. Sawa? So aqua grass what are we doing? Umeona? Mm. Bram unaona chukua mchezaji anaenda kwa national team, hawezi passata ball. Mm. Unaona? Mm. Unaona? Lakini kile ambacho mali tuko kwa academy sasa hii, ni hebu niambie tu sasa hata how many former players wanafanya kitu kwa ground. Ndio tuangalie kutoka tunaweza zipatia tucheze one music. Tusema in five years time tujaribu ni kutengeneza hapa chini. Mm. By the time watu wote kuja juu mm. tutakuwa tuko na vitu ziko poa. Everybody wants to go to the top. Mimi siwezi enda kule top na hapa chini pa maharibika. That's why na organization nataka ku change chini from the grass tukenda juu. Unaona? Kile itakuwa ngumu kwa sababu unapata hizi most of these decisions zinatoka huko juu zikikuja chini. Even the system. Let, let me tell you. Na ndio kitu kwanza amesema, Pamzo ngoja. Na ndio kitu kwanza anasema. So those are the those are the things federation kama Pamzo na kitu, mimi na kitu. Why can't we come together? to share ideas bole yetu ende mbele. Umeona? Mm. Because si kila mtu atakua chair, si kila mtu atakua vice chairman wa Nairobi, but naweza kwa niko na kwa school of excellence Nairobi mbali na nataka kutengisha bole ya Kenya. Mm. Ama niko Mombasa, a former player, ama pamzi kwa Kisumu, unaona? Kuna technical director, I don't know the channel everything to him. Mm. Umeona? Mm. Pamzo unasemaje juu ya story because because Musa has no, no. everything that, no. that 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 that, okay. that required to mm. i think to to take the reins pale in the federation because if the they problem will, is coming from up there they will think, bro they will never allow him to take it why not let me tell you why not? <laughs> kwa sababu gani they will never <laughs> let, let me tell you why yeah? <laughs> let me tell you why kwanza kitu ile we as former players 
mm. we are trying so much mm. kusaidia bodi ya mm. Kenya but vile tunaweza hata mm. nimefurahi sana unapata kumekuwa na organization ya KFF eh? KAF eh? mm. ya former Kaf. players Kaf. Yeah. Mm. ya former players yeah, Now, this this is the right channel mm. manake pia eh, miyake pia ni kusupport one of us Yeah. But Brown pia lazima tujue mm. not everybody can lead vile Musa anakuambia. Si kila mtu atakuwa chairman wa FKF. Mm. E, na zile job tuko nazo za ku develop football. Mm. Some of us we are so happy with those jobs. Mm. Tume sisi ni coach, sisi ni okay administrators pia. Mm. Sisi ni maref. So many so many former players in maref. But We, we are just trying eh, in one way or another to develop football. Now Bram mm. why inakuwa vigumu sana kwa former players kama mtu ameicheza yeah. kwa, kwa seat kwa top seat ni one kumekuwa pale. Polo Nyuera nimecheza naye alijaribu kwa pale Nairobi branch kwa Kachi Aman mm-hmm. ali face a lot of frustration. Mm. Eric Obura mm. alijaribu kusimama he faced a lot of frustration. Mm. Dan Shikanda ala, alijaribu kusimama he faced a lot of frustration. Mm. One there are so many cartels in our Kenyan football wale hawezi allow. Mm. Ifanyike. But mm. leave alone that. Wewe kama unataka kuwa top seat, mm. what are the top seat? Mm. Lazima uko na ground work poa. Lazima uko na mizizi. Because eh, mm. unaona juzi nani ali, alijaribu kuwa alijaribu kuwa president wa Ivory Coast. Uh, Drogba. Uh, drog, Drogba. Mm. But this guy research akufanya research yake poa. Mm. Akufanya research yake poa akuwa president. Because ukiangalia wale watu wako pale hivyo tayari washaeka mizizi. Mm. Regardless ni kitu gani wanafanya pale hivyo whether it is good ama ni mbaya but mm. tayari washaeka mizizi pale. Mm. But I'm will come ile tutaona any former players former players wanna end up for the big seat. Kama ilifanyika na kina Kalusha Bwale bona isifanyike na Kenya but former players wana face a lot of cartels eh? mm. ili to ngumu sana mtu kama hata Musa ama hata Panzo ajaribu ku, ku go for the big seat mm. alafu so, mambo ya mambo ya deo pia i think mm. uh, the, the come to elections za Kenya if you don't have money mm. na enye uwezi uwezi ku elected unaweza kuwa na maono poa mm. lakini enye una pesa bram hakuna mtu ata ku elect so mm. it's about think, money also bram Yeah. Nataka nat, nataka kunini hapo kwa Pamzo kwa sababu unajua angalia mm. ukita kusema hata former players I think less of them wako na resources si ndio mm. Na Bra mwenyewe nimekusema ukweli resources ni ganji ama do resources ni ganja wana una get ganji si mnasema tu kama kama mtu anasema hapa ah, ah, askiza askiza Bra mwambia askiza nataka kukwambia nipe nikita kuja kuchange Pamzo kita kuja kuchange Kenyan football ama kusimama pale ama Musa yeah. atakusimama pale Mm. We are the same same people tunataka so and so asimame. Mm. Si ndio? Mm. But hakuna vile Kenya utakuja uchaguliwe kama uja, ujaonga mtu. Mm. Right. No, no. Mm. Una una get. Kama na jo pamoja za chief. Hapo unaona? Mm. Kwa nini tu mie do ndio ni elected. Mm. Na the same same people wala nataka boli chenchiwe. Why? Mm. Ama ni aje. True. Hapo wala toko pale wakiona former player wanaona ni mm. kama bala opati ideas kutoka kwake wanani huli kama ni rival unaona mm. so mm. that is what is happening exactly una get mm. but maybe somebody ojo ni ki succeed sahi kick off to hope ki succeed mm. ule mtu anipatia ideas mm. ni somebody far away watasema mm. Musa amefanya nini ame succeed unaona yeah kama national team kama ni federation mm. all fans of the of Kenya mm. let's get the ideas and then to the to the pamoja unaona mm. mm. because pamza mkuja kusema hapa generation ya kina ya kina mbubi kapi ya kina mra, eh, mariga umeona mm. hizo zote zitakuwa noma sana kama kutakuwa na the player coming from uh, get mm. so kwa tu tunataka every time tutakuwa tu tuna unaona tunaweza ni kama yetu kwanza ti ah, tumefika ni sawa mimi nataka kuona Kenya team ya madem ime improve una get kuna allowance zao kuna chapa yao you, you talked about the figures mm. Uh, chapa mm. every time kuna wazao za hapo machali kama ni cup of nation lazima kwa tunacompete unaona mm. kama ni world cup tunako tuko pale unaona kwa kila categories but former players tuko pale what can we do to support each other unasema finance wise ideas wise 
Juu Kenya tuki tusipofungwa tukifungwa itakuwa mm. ni aje. Oh ni timu ya Nick, ni timu ya ya Nyamwea. Una get? Mimi mm. na kama kama hapa tulisema mm. kama we are valuing our players. Every mm. time nakuwa nazusha nikiambia eh hey, uacha lili mock for three good years. Mm. Unajua? Mm. Aje hiyo una ati huni msauti na nafai kumlipa. Una get? Mm. Kuna kuchujwa kuna 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 mtu anaitwa Kamara uh, talking of of nurturing the youth mm. and and and, and isom academy kuna mtu anaitwa mm. Kamara Oteshe anauliza what makes kick of kick of to hope unique as compared to other football academies academy yako iko tofauti nini naifanya na kwa unique na na hizi academies zingine cuz academy pia ni mwabu i think first of all there kuna two things mm. kuna kuna daycare na kuna academy mm. so a lot of Academy za hapa ni dekia. Kwa nini nasema dekia? Mm. Madhe atacha mto hii for mm. a, saa tatu akuja kumchukua saa sita. Hiyo ni dekia. Hakuna mm. vile mto hii wa, wa 10 years at train more than 2 hours. Mm-hmm. What is different at kick off to hope? First of all, kick off mm. to hope tunatumia tool ya football to preach mm. the gospel of Jesus Christ. Mm. Mm. Na pili tuko na tunajua mtoto unaenda deep kwa mtoto. Mtoto anafai kufanya nini kwa kila stage? Mm. This is what a, mtu wa under 10 anafai kucheza ball gani anafai kucheza kwa kionje na kaikoaje yuko na coach yuko aje umeona mm, mm. they was just studying that picture tuna coaches wala kwa well qualified umeona mm, mm. so kila mtu ana time yake kuna time ya kutrain watoto wa 12 years 13 years mm. category because our most important thing ni kuna god mm. na tuna develop tuna develop mchezaji mm. i think kenya mm. team bana bram mchezaji mm. ya deep position yake gani aje yake ni gani umeona mm. Mm. Bram hakuna player ametoka Kenya ameenda upro mm. akaenda kwa team akaingia direct na kacha direct. Wao mm. wanaenda mali kwanza wanaka for three months kuna mm. kitu wa melak mm. ndio afundisho. Kwa nini tuzimfundisha kama tuko very early? Unaona? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Pamzo. If I, Bram hapo tu kidogo kwa youth eh. Mm. Mm. I think uh, Kenya atuna order ya youth eh. Mm. One eh, mm. there has to be very good structure. Mm. Kila mtu anakuja na youth yake. Mm. Bram kuna watu wale wana make do na youth kuna watu wale wako very honest hiyo mm. ni deke hapa mtu ah si wewe musa <laughs> you are very honest ah anasema <laughs> wala na make do pamzo kunisikia nimesema wala na make do ni deke ya mm. deke anachamtoi wake, no, wake hapo anachamtoi wake hapo unamchunga musa si academy hiyo ni far away from kitu unasema eh hiyo ni far Wewe story yako ni understand. Story yako ni understand because hata anaijua. And you are a very honest guy. Mimi nasema youth. Youth okay. centers. Mm. Unapata there so many youth say. Mm. Wadau pia wako na youth zao. Mm. But it's not bad. Lazima ziwe structured. Mm. Na lazima wa work through mm. technical director. I don't know kama technical director ana say these youth. I don't mm. know if ka technical director of Kenya is aware about this youth. Mm. Because Mr Unaka- staki kuona utapata mm. youth maybe mm. iko kule iko kule kisumu yeah. but some is taking advantage mm. parents wana to ado mm. lakini unapata hata ile tu Musa amesema ile coaching mm. i use it a lot of players so mm. we have to know what kind of coaches want to handle our youth because youth are very important mm. to me only about eh, mm. Kenya Queen Cup of Nations yeah for us to win cup of nations ama kuko tuna, tuna tuna qualify after every two years eh mm. ni pale kwa youth mm. na the structures eh, na unaona kama german kitu walifanya walikuja mm. waka research wakapata yenyewe after ile world cup walifanya vibaya sana mm. wakaanza na youth na ndio tukakuja tukapata wakenya zile maana mm. all qualified coaches mm. kama hapa Kenya tu all qualified coaches wale wana CAF A mm. unapata wale wakona wakona licenses za uh, UEFA Yeah. Alliances. Wote wali wali handle the youth. Kutoka pale mm. chini. And that is why after 10 years walipata hiyo result. So, Bram, mm. mimi wasiwasi yangu ni mm. wale the kind of guys wale wana 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 handle wachezaji wetu. Mm-hmm. Sasa tukienda kumalizia because uh, muda pia umetupatia kisogo. Kuna watu walikuwa nakusengenya pale kwa Facebook uh, Pamzo. Yes. Moja ni Hillary Owishe. Bill, hey. swajua so Bill. Hey. <laughs> na Boni, ambani. Hey. Wote walikuwa nauliza history ya Mwape Miti. Mm-hmm. Nasema ule Mwape Miti wa Zambia ni nani? Unapokuwa mm-hmm. bonge la chenga, mabiatu akaanguka chini na akashika handi. 
Refa mm-hmm. kupiga firimbi aliwika mm-hmm. play on. Ilibidi mm-hmm. mafans waharibu game. Hawa mm-hmm. kuharibu game. Mm-hmm. Na kitu ile iko hata Musa alikuwa hapo hivyo. Top defenders upigwa gachenga. Unajua top defender kipigwa chenga, yeye itaongele itaongelewa sana mpaka siku ile tadai. Hata hata Van Dijk juzi alipigwa chenga. Watu wameongea mpaka sasa hivi because it is very rare one top defender abepigwa chenga. Yes. Eh. Hey. Unasema it is very rare ambe yani mbedi ya chenga angu. Eh apigwa chenga defender yes. very very rare. Akichengwa kama minuka. Akichengwa itaonekana sana. <laughs> Pamza hizi ko pande yako. Eh, wewe sababu bibi msalaba yake. Hai Pamza. Ah, si Musa. Musa si ilikuwa game za Zambia na tulikuwa na kwambia tulikuwa defense. Ilikuwa ni mimi, wewe, Francis Odwor, Francis Odwor na Kwarula. Kwarula was there, eh. Eh, walipeleka Pamza. Ba tata hivyo Brian, eh. Bram. Tumekuwa gana defense poor sana. Eh, very good defense. So, hizo ni vitu wazina fresh out. Sasa kawaida. Nimeona nuli hiyo swali because wamekuwa kinisumbua sana. Eh, alafu kuna kwa Dino, Dino Haji. Dino Haji. Eh, question question to both coaches who I look up to. Which way to go as far as Kenfoka or Kefoka? What is their opinion on the two bodies which both claim to represent Kenyan coaches in Kenya? Confusion. Naweza sema ni confusion. Lakini we just easy body zote mbili lazima tukuje tu pamoja lazima tukuje pamoja mm-hmm. and then to make a very a very solid body manake sasa hii tutataka watu na represent my coaches eh? there's mm-hmm. so many things that tunafaa kufanya mm-hmm. na i think uh, isiwe itakuwa tena ni mm-hmm. mambo na bodies na kuja mobe because kuna elections alafu after elections that vitu zimepotea we don't want that mm-hmm. tunataka ikuwe na continuity So whichever body itakuwa hapo hivyo tunataka ikuwe very very solid because ukiangalia hata hizi mm. body zote ume, umetaja hakuna elections zishafanya. Mm. Mm. Oteshe. I, I think me bado naweza kuambia Bram. Mm. Can foka ke foka na cup in. Kuna makoche za wale tulipitia mikono zao the, the old guard kuna the new technology may come in. Mm. Why can't they just come together tuangalie nini tunaweza tengeneza kwa kwa Kenyan football hata into coaching unajua mm. unaget mm. because kila mtu anataka kuwa na ki, na kipawa na hiyo ndio kitu na i think ina kill ball ya Kenya unaona mm. una kama mahali au ataka tuende ulianzisha mimi niko kwa both unaona mm. but everybody kuna ule coach nilipitia pale ni learn something ya kitambo okay. na ya sasa why, why can they just come together with whatever mm. knowledge they have unajua mm. kusaidia Kenyan football unaona mm. because hawa patani kwa nini True. Um, eh, I think I think pia hapo tu Musa hizo vitu tunaweza sema eh, eh. ni ni zimekuwa too personal sana eh. Hao watu wamekuwa pale hivyo. Too personal eh. Na ni vitu wazifai kuendelea. Sawa bro. Uh, I think uh hiyo imejibiwa fiti na tunaenda kuwind up sasa show. Um the same same uh, Dino anasema I want to congratulate Musa Otieno for the good job he's doing with the kids and the academy. And then I want to challenge Pamzo to nurture the next generation of footballers and I would also wish to see more of his involvement in grassroots football. Pamzo kuna kitu kitu yote unafanya kuemta? Yeah of course Bram ni kuna teams mob sana za majunior. Mhm. Eh na Hamza Heroes. Na hiyo Hamza Heroes ilikuwa ni Buda. Na sana sana hiyo ni wakati maybe nilikuwa bado nacheza mpaka nikakuja nikawaza. Na Hamza Heroes ilikuja ikatoa wachezaji wazuri sana. Mm-hmm. Then of course so hapa na pale mimi wanasaidia vijana mm-hmm. especially wa mtaani mm-hmm. but uh, job yangu yenyewe ni kubizi sana ku, ku concentrate sana na nini na youth, youth development football good stuff ongondo pia alikuwa ameleta story ya maze cob hapo paki but hiyo ni kitu i think ilikuwa kwa kwa nini yako uh, yeah, tukifungua yeah. and then uh, waulize when they will take up the federation and bring some sanity in our football fraternity Musa anadai FKF how much Oteshe huyu jamaa anaitwa Mus Joe anasema uko na deni federation wameshakulipa pesa yako yote I think unafikiria naweza Abraham hoja nilipa pesa yangu yote na get that is something na mtu anaweza kwa nini unajua ama ama kwa nini saidi wanatokea nilisikia watu wake make my comment Mm. sometimes una unapiga gavito zingine na prayers unaona mm. 
nilipokuwa kwenye mwea i think alitupatia job nilikuwa nafanya super sport mm. i think we sign a very good uh, letter for being signed as a assistant coach mm. i think uh, up to date naweza sema kama maybe sile saving kidogo nilikuwa nimefanya mm. maybe ningekuwa musotino alikuwa others mm. so around for three good years sikuwa nimepata salary getting some allowances which mm. is but again unaangalia unasema tukitaka kuleta tena mtu kama huyo kwa kwa federation nini anasema tu ni yenyewe tunajibari zote i can say no no mm. Mm. we just need to get somebody who's sober mm. somebody who's there for the players both women both men mm. at least to end another level no no hata kama si Musa Musa za kwa pale ka support mtu mwingine kwa level why can't we just sing one song song mm. tunataka as mm. former players as Kenyans to support what is happening for us mm. to go to another level mm. na get mm. Eh pamzo una kitu yote unataka kuuliza Musa ama kama kuna kitu yoyote ile unataka siri yake yote ile unataka kuuliza siku si, no siku sikia Musa kisema kama ashalipo eh mm. sijalipo eh, pamzo sijalipo oh. sijalipo unaona kwa nini nimetouch hiyo kitu eh mm. kuna time ule coach wa huyo coach alikuwa juzi wa Rambe Stars eh huyo mm-hmm. juzi juzi mzungu wa France eh mm. mimi mm. eh, alikuwa met, eh, alikuwa ametuita pale vo mm alikuwa ametuita pale kama makoches wote. Hiyo mm-hmm. time tu ndiye ameingia na alikuwa anajaribu ku assemble team yake mm-hmm. na kupata pia opinion yetu. I think huo ndio coach wa kwanza tu ni mwana foreigner mm-hmm. amekuja kaita makoche mm-hmm. to get opinion yake. But after hapo tu kumsikia sana. But kitu ili ni kitu ili ni uwaro sana hiyo time eh. Mm-hmm. Unaona tukienda hapo hivyo nilipata Musa hapo hivyo. Mm-hmm. Hapo hapo federation. Mm-hmm. So nikauliza Musa eh mzee nimekuja hii situation ama ni vipi ati oh pamzo mm. kuna vitu zangu nimekuja kuangalia hapa hivi but bro eh? yeah. it's very very disappointing eh mm. unapata mtu amepatia hii country very long service eh? mm. both playing na hata kama coach eh? mm. and then anaanza kufuatilia vitu zake mm. that is very very sad eh? nafikiri respect itakuwa inakuja tu mm. mimi nishakupatia service nishapatia service eh? just mm. pay me to achane Yes mm. pay me to attend. Mm. Now it is high time pia watu wanze ku respect uh, former players because we have really played a very big part eh, mm. to develop body ya Kenya in terms of playing eh, na hata coaching yetu kwa hapa hivi. So it's a matter of respect. Ukiniona pale kwa kwa hivyo si hata nimekuja kuchukua job yako. But wewe nipe tu akiamu. Fadhela, Fadhela anasema miaka tatu bila salary. We Gori Kenyan football. Kuna dem anaitwa Grace Mwelu. Grace Mwelu anasema ambia Musa we appreciate his role in Kenyan soccer story. He is an icon from being the most capped player to uh, to, uh, to to date inspiring the next generation of footballers through the program he does with kids, not forgetting the role he continues to play with active players at the PSL and beyond. Potesho umesikia hiyo? Grace Mwelu amekupatia hapo. Bonge I think your brand kitu tuliko nimesema ujeshafika mahali kuna mahali uliko umesema ni kwa part of the national team mm. unajua tulikuwa assemble na kochoku kwanza mm. nashukuru sana kuwa kuna mtu kama kochoku haikuwa mm. easy Lodo kwanza tukuangalia ati eh ukumbi ati nilikuwa nimetoka mimi mm. kwanza nilikuwa naitwa mtu wa nyamoya because mm. ilikuwa very difficult mm. at ninge work na the, the new generation ile ilikuwa na come in but mm. ukumbi nilikuwa ukumbi kitambo tulimit kuna team ya national team ilikuwa under 20 ilikuja hapo uh, ndio relationship yetu ilianza mm. imagine mm. that is a time where a national team comes with one playing kit on mm. get mm. Mm. out of my pocket nika buy a team uniform nika make team ili kama team na hiyo ilikuwa mm. national team mm. that is how a relationship will come na ukumbi so hata mm. mimi nikipoa job na ukumbi kwanza i think uh, naweza sema ukumbi kama ngekuambia watu Mm. ingekuwa ni noma sana because i think there are so many negative things pengine mm. na nini pamza za kuambia atupendani pia as, as coaches unaona ala imetoka so, kutoka kwa players as kwa coaches anaweza <laughs> kuambia that is something he loves anaweza kuambia cuz my player my player ile nimekuwa ni interview hapo alikuwa anasema my players wapendani sasa hata anasikia tena ma coaches wapendani nani anapenda mwingine kama mtu alisema kuna mtu anasema yeah, lazima kuwe na solution bali ya kusema players wapendani ama coaches wapendani mbona tusikuje tuseme mimi nataka kuanza na hiyo upendo mimi nataka kuanzisha hiyo upendo coaches wapendani because na cheki kama vile unasikia pamza anasema jamani kulikuwa na that uh, situation which will come na head coach aku perform mm. you got the point 
Hakuna Manuel Sama tiko na round table. Pamza akiniona tu kwa team yake tu hivi ama kwa session yake anajua eh job yangu inaenda. Na get. Unajua mm. once nilikuwa na coach FC Talanta. Mm. Na kuambia FC Talanta tulikaa pale karibu aia mm. without salary to mm. Na I think I brought in an assistant coach kumbe hapo ndio nilikuwa nimejitimbia. Mm. Ninaoma sana. Mm. Oh kitani hivi anatani hivyo vingine. Una get. <laughs> But uh, I decided kwenda kwa academy. Yeah. I think tuangalie what you can do because Bram mm. tusidanganyane hao makocho wako hapa around. Mm. Ninaoma. Pamza za pagia za kuambia it is not healthy Jamu in Kenyan football. Jamu I think uh, uh, healthy. Mhm. Jamu apokro tuko na time kidogo sana so Okay. Okay. Eh. I think Bram si mambo na watu wapendani because uh, I think uh, watu makoches wao na cup pamoja tunaongelishana. Mm. To see to see same kuna ile kuna ile competition coaches za competitive ile kila coach utakaka kushinda game yake mm. so isikuwe watu wanasema coaches wapendani because uh, maybe uh, ni com- ni ya competition i think all all hizi vitu zote ni competition mm. but si Mourinho walikuwa na fight gina na nipa leo na venga mm. wewe pamzo pamzo yes, i understand there is, there is a lot of passion in terms of coaching Mm. You said Musa. I understand your situation Pamzo. You get the mm. point. Na najua mm. passion ya ku, ya kufunga. Una get? Kwa sababu gani Pamzo anasema hivyo? Mm. Sasa wewe Pamzo una coach KCB. Mm-hmm. Yes or no? Ana coach mm-hmm. Posta, Posta Rangers. Una coach Posta? Nilitoka KCB. Ulitoka KCB? Yes, yes. Game imeisha. Watch at game. Happens Pamzo umechukua coach wa team fulani. You mm-hmm. can have a coffee with him. We discuss about football. Shafanya, shafanya. Sita tajia but shafanya. Shafanya. Yeah. Unaona kwa hii industry eh? Wacha nikwambie. Kwa hii industry kuna, kuna jamaa anaitwa Edwin Odipo anasema hii ni coaches wa KNVB versus other coaches. <laughs> <laughs> Bram. Hii. <laughs> Bram. Hii. <laughs> More or less. <laughs> kuna ukweli fulani. Kuna kuna ukweli fulani. Eh. Kuna ukweli, Musa. Yeah. Histo histo ya makoch na Daniel tutamaliza. So I think uh, Pamzo na na, na Uteshe yustaki pia ni waeke sana. Unajua Musa alisema Musa alisema Pamzo ni player mchezaji wa kitambo. Labda ishafika masa yake ya kupiga kadu uzo. So Eh, <laughs> 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 uh, kwako tena coaches uh, Pamzo. Uko na anything ile unafikiri unataka kutoka kwa Roo ama kama uko na any 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 word of yeah. advice, any word of advice to the upcoming coaches or upcoming players ile unataka kuambia. Just summarize. Bram, niko na niko na advice eh. Last show kiko hapa hivi. Mm. uli ulikome ulikome host uh, former players wawili hapo hivyo yeah. then uh, kuna former player moja mm. and you were really talking about a sensitive subject ilikuwa betting yes betting, betting. Mm. then who player alikuja akasema too much fixing much fixing oh sorry way. yeah exactly mm. then who uh, you who you visitor wako alikuja akasema mm. yeye yeah, kama ni shujaa talamba mm. yeah, kama ni shujaa talamba you see this is wrong Mm. for a mtu amekuwa legend mtu amecheza ball eh mm. mimi sitapenda kuona players mm. wetu akiharibu jina zao because of betting mm. so to, because of match fixing to see encourage players because of an, eh to see encourage players at kulamba shuge although sikuwa najua ti anamaanisha nini but the way he was talking eh ilikuwa mm. inamaanisha yeye yeah, anaweza fix match mm. coaches wengi Mm. Wame put the ball job zao jia games mm. because any time any time unashinda mm. una job any time una lose uko yenye ni 50 50 jika mtakuwa mimi nataka kama coach anapoteza ama kama team inapoteza game iko mm. one si ati mtu amechangia so mm. in terms of uh, easy match fixing mm. tumeona yenye results za match fixing zimekuwa mbaya Mm. Siezi penda tu encourage players wetu sisi kama former players eh, walambe shuje that is very very wrong mm. then bram mm. tumeona teams imekuwa gana problems in mm. terms of fra- infrastructure mm. grounds nimekwambia mm. tu sisi tulikosa kuchukua cup of nations because mm. yeah hatukuwa na study enough 
Bram teams zimekuwa zinateseka unapata kwanza especially Nairobi teams mm. teams zimekuwa zinateseka unapata team iko home lakini mm. inaenda Machakos ama inaenda Narok ama unapata Goro wa home wanaenda Kisumu mm. but sahi nyayo stadium ime imeisha yeah. which is very very good Mm. Lakini sasa wadau especially wadau basi tusianze kuvunja zile viti. Zile viti ni very smart. Hao ni mafanu. Mata... Tuseme tu mafanu wa gori. Wadau. Mafanu wa gori. Wadau. Ah ah. Wadau. 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 Wewe wewe ndio umesema hiyo. Sasa hizi mafanu wa sofa paka wamevunja viti. I want a fans. Exactly. Costa wana fans. Mafanu wa gori na FC ndio wanavunja hizo viti. So tuweke wadau. Watu wa wadau. So tuangalie Tuangalie hizi studies zetu. Mimi mazee sitaki ati mazeti yangu inacheza na Nairobi lakini tunaenda Wiz Kisumu. Tunaenda kucheza tunapeleka game Kisumu. Mm. Haitasaidia mm. big develop ball hapa Nairobi. True. <laughs> yeah. uh, coaches unajua <laughs> nyote ni ma coach. Uh, Oteshe just in, in, in very few words eh? in very few words because time yenyewe imeisha kabisa but uh, kuna oh. <laughs> kuna wengi sana wanauliza kwani mimi ndio na haraka nyie hata mna haraka. Hatu na haraka. Wanasema mimi ndio nawarakisha. Yeah, I think so uh, in in very few words I want you to 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 speak of something very different from what Pamza amesema because I think amesema kila kitu. Nataka tu uniambie in very few words initiative yako hiyo ya ya, ya watu hii pale Dr. Kraf eh, inadi ni, ni kuna, juzi ulikuwa una, unafanya story ya hii story ya COVID ulikuwa unapelekea ma, ma familia ma food na vitu kama hizo. Have you achieved your target ama bado unataka tukupige jeka hapa? Niambi hawa niko na marafiki wengi wanaona kutoka states huko wanatuma kitu. Kwanza naweza sasa sasa kushukuru kwanza Karola Dul kwa hiyo mm-hmm. hiyo hiyo initiative mm-hmm. I get I to support sana. Na I think mambo ya covid I think kila mtu ana anasafa. Na get. Na sisi as, as at kick off to hope tuliona pia wachezaji mm-hmm. unajua wewe ni coach wewe ni mentor wewe ni father. Mm. Nikaangalia niko na hao tu yetu pia mtaani sisi tunataka tu sasa kuna ball. Mm. What can we do at least pia to feel vile hao na feel. Mm. Unaona? Jumi Musa Maliniko na kula tu vizuri lakini una, una training skill hizo kwa poa nini inafanyika. Mm. So we came we came up with the initiative hii mambo ya covid tumejaribu kupatia foods kwa watu wachezaji wetu kwanza tunaanza na wachezaji wetu mm. tukienda kwa community. So far so good unapata tumesha serve families karibu 501 families 501 wow. through wow. diaspora watu wa Kampo Yoyo wakina deep au US mm. Karol Radul kwanza amefanya very big uh, inajua zingine yeah, zinakuwa behind the scene tari, yeah. marketing moja mzuri sana na sema tu asante sana mm-hmm. this play for more because what we all mtaani mm. kick of to hope mm. we are there as a family what mm. to keep safe as a family mm. kitu ngine nataka kusema pengine ni off the top I think sometimes pia naweza sema federation mm. kuna the good side na kuna the bad side what mm. pia leo tusema kwa the good side si ndio bana kama ni hadi tusema kwa kwa ni the good side at least mm. tunajua the good side unapata pia kuna bit of a structure mm. i think nafikiri tu pengine Kenyans tumekata pia kwa a day to whatever the federation is doing yeah kwa pale katim cup of nation unajua right. kuna mm. about so the incentive players mm. pia wamekuwa nalipwa mm. like, una get mm. so kuna good things wana do na kuna the bad things wanafanya the bad things zile mm. wanafanya kuna the former players wakina pamzo kwa hapa well qualified coaches na with respect mm. can you just call them to tuangalie nini tunaweza saidiana ndio mm. tutatue whatever is happening to Kenyan football unaona no, ukiangalia mm. mtu kama coach Davy kwa na madem madem mm. wamekuwa wanafanya vizuri sana but we are not supporting the women as such ndio mm. pia lazima tuwa support unajua mm. mali mm. kitu ni nzuri ni nzuri mali kitu ni mbaya wacha tuangalie tuna rekebisha ama mm. niaje si ndio bana Abraham kuna kuna jamaa anaitwa Ochiwe Ida alikuwa ananiambia hapa to just ask them a thing or two about women football but I've purposely uh, stayed away from uh, the women's football topic because um, show yangu ya next uh, this Sunday nitakuwa na an all all female uh, panel watakuja watuambie uh, mambo yao but bro, yeah. hey. unajua nilikuwa part of the women team na get na nikiangalia kwa national team I was coaching the under 20 ukiangalia mm. wachezaji wengi sasa yuko pale na coach Jacqueline unaona mm. Mm. lazima tuwa support hata kama mademo atakuja kusema ikitakuwa kwa men pia watu na tunawa support because hata sisi hapa chini tuna mademo no. mademo made, 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 wako na noma mob sana oteshe sijui unataka <laughs> <laughs> no mimi nasema tu nasema tu in general unajua in general <laughs> lazima pia tuangalie pande yao na tuangalie pande yetu but again 
nasema tu ile kitu poa kama kitu ni nzuri wacha ikuwe nzuri si ndio kama kitu ni mbaya otesha otesha nikianza nikianza hii show i think i think my my eh? second show my second show nileta 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 dem kwa panel and i promise to be bringing more women uh, on the panel na nijaribu na, na, na jaribu sana mimi mtu nimezaliwa kwa familia ma, 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 ma dem wengi so go just wacha nimalize na, na, bramo the, the bramo ya wacha pia wacha Otesha ukibonga mimi napita bidi nitulie. Bonga. <laughs> okay, nimetulia. Ah, nimesema hata yeah. dem akiongea juu ya machali itakuwa yeah. ni a plus. Yeah. A voice kutoka kwa men kindo kwa madem pia itakuwa ni a plus. Na get true. That is ndio nasemaje mimi mimi ile kitu nilikuwa nime nimepurpose nime kufanya. I think issue nilikuwa nimeambia madem pia yani voice yao itakuwa hard more often na shida zao zile okay, kidogo zile tunaweza settle tunaweza pia jaribu kusaidia because tukianza tena hiyo topic saa hizi tutachukua another one hour kwa story ya madem. Ni sawa. Hapo yeah. sawa. Hapo sawa. Pamzo, kuna yes. unataka kuturusha bomu moja hapo kwa kwa otesha ama tu Ah ah, ute... nimemzoea. Huyu ni message hapo amekwambia umsamee bwana. <laughs> Hakuna angalia. Ah, ushagurumisha pesa hapo. Pamzo, wacha nikwambie. Ojiwa Bram, eh? Mm. Nimesema mm. ama coach zetu. Huu pamzo ni coach, si ndio? Mm. Hakuna mm. zikwasha piga tu kasimu akasema, "Ai uteshi, unaweza kufanya job na wewe kweli. At least hata ulibebe yako tu balls." Upanzo ni mbaya sana. Mulika. Umuuliza kwa nini? Ashai kuja huko kwa academy yako huko. Wacha hata kwa academy, hata kwa Upanzo. Academy, Musa hizi. Unajua Bram, mimi utembelee Musa sana kwa academy. <laughs> na nafanya job. Musa, eh. Unajua kama coach ukitakuwa successful eh? Eh. Lazima technical bench yako iwe very very strong. Hiyo ni mm. kitu nimekuja nikapitia. Na, na kutizi. So, na Ebu omba siku moja ni kwa coach wa Rambistas. Mm. Mm. Eh? Utakuwa tu hapo. Utaniita pia mimi niko hapo. <laughs> Team manager. Kama ni hiyo Musa ndio tuko hapo. Eh. Apa apa na lakini acha kukwambie yenye Pamzo acha tu kukwambie tu Bram. Yenye I respect this guy. Na zaa tukisema ukweli. Hata hata top man. Hata into coaching acha tu nikwambie tu ukweli. Na believe hata tukienda kwa ile course walifanya machakos mimi sikuenda nilikuwa nilikuwa Burundi at that time. Yeah? Mm. I think it's the top in the class. Bongo mbaya. Si ndio Pamzo? True. True. But he has never been given an opportunity. Tumpatieni pia yeye that opportunity. Pamzo, Amane, that's it. Pa- Pamzo hapo mimi sina doubt na kuna kitu moja ulikuwa unataka kuambia wadau kale ka kitu ka ebu kale ka kitu ka kagore ebu kaseme sasa hii. Sema hiyo kitu sema. Sema ile kitu gani? Unajua wewe ndio unajua. Ah, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Na ni true story. Mimi yeye ni shandol players wengi sana. Players wengi sana. But Ngare ngoja Alex Ngare Uchiweida Ali Blackburn sikizeni story. Mm, mm, but kuna offensives nishawe handle. True story Musa. Kuna offensives yeah. nishawe handle. Mimi bado waga na wainulia. Kuna Maldes, Paul Were. Mm-hmm. Then kuna Bram Karamoja. Bram Karamoja nilimwandola akiwa Gormaia. Speed winger. Bram ndio anatumia mguu yake kulia lakini ni mzuri sana upande wa kushoto maana yake alikuwa na katim speed winger Musa na Ucheli let me tell you see at na fresh mtu Ucheli because alicheza ball for a very short time sijui ni shughuli gani alienda kakimbilia but Ucheli alicheza for a long time unaona hii team nasema wange win cup of nations na hii team hata wange qualify world cup Bram alikuwa ndani this guy was a very good player Pamzo usiongeze si utaribu usiongeze wacha 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 Unajua hao wame hao wamekuonaga tu ukianza kufanya hizi vitu zako ni na nini wamekuona kwa na hiyo tumbo tumbo yako tumbo akuta eh hey, but hawa <laughs> kuporo ki wa speed winger mm. tafi baba mm. true so eh, watu wale mlikuwa Chris unajua Chris pia alikuwa gatiem Chris Darling huyu Madrid alikuwa hey, hey, tu, hey, yeah, go re Eh so mm. mimi naambiaga watu sasa ingine watu wakisema wa kwa na ball nasema nimecheza na watu watu wana kurudi para so i think mm. kutoka kwako pia coaches hapo eh, ime clear hizo doubt zote so if karuni, karuni, to, eh, eh tuki, maybe au watu wajui mm. tulikuwa hata saa zingine tunakosa transport ya kusafiri hiyo ni gormaia lakini sikizi gormaia wana safari na ndege mm. big plus very big plus Pamzo tulikuwa tunaenda game so ni tunarudi saa 6 ya usiku tunaikuwa pale ambapo tumepewa 70 bob 
70 yeah, bobu exactly. share ni 100 bob mazee oteshe ina yeah. kuingia monte carlo mm. kwanza upige karege mpaka asubuhi alafu utembee mpaka mimi nilikuwa naishingara so nilikuwa natembea tu mpaka hapo mta pamzo thank you very much for for hizo sifa umenipatia <laughs> watu wataona moto huko kwa facebook wewe ngoja tumalize <laughs> <laughs> so i think tumemaliza hii story uh, nataka nataka pamzo na mjiandae mnipatie kikosi yenu but uh, parting shot mshapeana hiyo story mm-hmm. ya racism tulikuwa tumeanza show na story ya racism ni kitu inafanyika mm-hmm. sana uh, mtanisamee tu leo show imeenda sana because uh, the panel is, is is too rich with wisdom na lazima ni wakamue tu leo cause wapata tani mm-hmm. noma hiyo story ya racism mm-hmm. mkicheza kuna jamaa ameuliwa huko state size watu wanaleta noma exactly. na man market mm-hmm wa Kenya wetu hata wengine huko atujua kwa aje unajua lazima mm. tuchiki cheki hiyo story ile mm. affect kwa career yenu hiyo story ya racism eh, eh, bra mimi naweza sema kwanza nilikuwa lucky nikicheza mm. pro yangu india siku mm. siku ona kitu kama hiyo mm. ndio wale ni waindi alafu pia mafurahano zingine walikuwa nakuja kutoka brazil na nini na nini mm. but sikuja ku encounter kitu kama hiyo kwa my playing career but nili encounter hii kitu wakati nilikuwa nimeenda trials bonmouth Mm-hmm. Bonmouth ndiye namba 2 eh. Mm-hmm. Na nakumbuka hata ule coach coach alikuwa hapo hivyo alikuwa very very racist. Yeah. Manake kwanza team ikisafiri mm-hmm. yenyewe utapata hata ili transport siko wanapata. Manake team ilikuwa na, inaenda kila mtu alikuwa anaenda na gari yake. Mm-hmm. So wewe kama coach eh, lazima uangalie wachezaji hii, wachezaji wamebaki nyuma mm-hmm. hawana gari watakuwa nafikaje ground. So huyo coach hapo anashughulika because ya rangi yangu. Mm-hmm. Then unapata huyo coach hata tukienda tizie Mm. E, unapata ataki kukuguzisha mm. anakuangalia hata kuna ile encouragement anakupatia yani anakuonyesha tu mm. you in the wrong place so mm. hii ndio kitu nili encounter sana kwa kwa boli yangu but i think musa naye huko kule alikuwa it was too much unless maybe kama ilikuja kachenga but mimi hizo ndio situation zangu bro oteshe tupeleke chap chap ya ilikuwa ni yenyewe mimi nili encounter a lot Mm. Unapata the challenge ilikuwa ni yenyewe ma foreigners walikuwa wanapendana tu sana. Mm. Na cheki hata ilikuwa tu ni bad ni kama business. Nyimu mm. lakaa mcheze ball, mm. unapata hata mtu hata maybe hata kama mkalad kuja kwako mm. ilikuwa ni ni hard sana. Mm. Hard sana yani. Ama tu umechukua umeenda kwa hawa ya mkalad mm. ilikuwa tu ni noma. So mm. tulikuwa tuna tulikuwa tuna die ki silent. Unajua mm. ilikuwa mm. uoneshu lakini haiko pale kwa open lakini mnaona tu mtakutaki. Mmeenda pengine pande ya visa, mm. unajua unaenda kucheza Mm. Napata tu blacks wanaka pamoja, mm. makala zao pamoja, but mm. nime encounter hata nikimaliza ball at sasa na coach at Santos. Mm. Bado yani ilikuwa tu ni awoni mtu black tu yani design. You're not one of us. Mm. Mm. E unajua ya. Yeah. So ilikuwa na ndio vitu pengine napata hata home kikuja home bado. Ni kama mm. bado uko na watu wenyu lakini bado ni kama ni kama uko kwa foreign country. Mm. Unaona? Mm. So sama unapata tu yani bado hata hata Kenya tu bado hata into coaching ama into playing bado tunaipata. Unajet? Mm. Mm. Aku, akupendi una, unaona tu design iko tu but mm. uh, South Africa nilipata a lot. A lot, a lot naweza kuambia. Abdul, Abdul, Abdul excuse me. Abdul alienda Abdul Waroya, Abdul alienda UK maze. Akakuwa mauka. Excuse me. Na muita na London based. Anasema Sami um, Uh, UK it's your responsibility to get yourself to the ground eh uh, wish pia hapo naona na tu ametune in boy takaloki alikuwa anakuuliza swali ya paki kuhusu wale ma players wale wame, watu wale wametoka paki but hiyo ni kitu pia uli, ulipiga kwa intro udipo chali chali nimesoma comment yako hapo umenipasha but haina mambo na unajua pale ndakupata uh, kuna Hassan Medi Hassan Medi ni jama fulani yani anako very unlucky pale kwa pale kwa page yangu ya, ya Facebook mimi huko ikaga credit appreciation post hajawahi pata credo so nilimwambia <laughs> nilimwambia skwile nilimwambia safari ni ndefu siku moja atapata but Hassan Medi this one goes out to you since umelalamika sana fanya hivi after show nitumie message pale inbox i think ndaku surprise ndakutumia ndakutumia credo wewe ni mtu wangu usikuwe na wasiwasi So kuna watu wengi Beril Beril wa Kisumu Beril eh, Beril kina Sharon Afande madem wote na waletea mm-hmm. show on Sunday ya madem tupu so kama mko na kama mko na maswali zozote kama mko na any pressing issues kama mko na any initiatives on the sides you know what to do get in touch alafu tujue tutafanya vipi eh, Vini Akarash eh, David Ochieng anasema Musa has now settled thank you 
eh, Alex Ndare, Eugene Meso anapiga za kengele. Meso alikuwa amepotea kuna time alikuwa amepotea. Meso yeye. Yeah. Najua kwa nini alikuwa amepotea. Eh, Azizo Habert Murunga yeye pia alikuwa anacheza bolu huko Kanyasporu huko Taki yeye ni legend baya. Kuna time walinem wali kikosi hapa akasema yeye hataki kwa kwa kikosi so wakamdondoa <laughs> vivi. <laughs> vivi Niva Amosochien Ochiweda Koko Mestro Joe Obuya Olango eh Chris Jared Migunde Boita Agripa Nyanje show inaona na watu wengi sana Pamzo na na Musa. Tuanze na Pamzo. Nipe kikosi <laughs> your best 11. Sasa <laughs> so, unacheka, unacheka nini Buda? Why you, what's funny? Mimi niko na very strong team. Number one. Very very strong team. Number one. Pamzo, ngoja Pamzo best 11. Ehe. Kenya tumekuwa na makipa but mm. uh, my top keeper ndiye mm. Otamax, Sefans. Matthew Ish. Otamax, Sefans. Ngoja, number one, Matthew Otamax. Matthew Otamax. Otamax. Otamax ataleta Madrid hapo mtafungwa yauri yako. Mm. Eh? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mimi Bram nikita mtu najua quality yake. Then na kwa nini? Mimi natuzisha 352. 352. Mariko tulia. Yes. <laughs> Mariko anasema ni akataka kumtaja. Eh? Uh-huh. Number 2. 352. Oh 352. Okay, unacheza na mawing backs. Mm. Eh? Niko na stoppers, niko na stoppers watatu. Kwa stoppers watatu Bram. Mm. Kwa stoppers watatu. Mm kuna Musa Utieno Musa Utieno leader top defender uh-huh. then niko na niko na Paul Chien Paul Chien amecheza Gormaya na amecheza FC Leopards Pau eh, Paul Chien Kunde uh-huh. then kuna Pamzo hii hi defense kama unataka ichezwe itachezwa ukikuja pia na nguvu yako pia tutaenda hivyo hivyo very strong defense. Very strong defense. Then Ukuf kwa flanks. Eh. Kado unajua Arambi tumekuwaaga na players wazuri sana. Okay na Abud. Okay na Marcelo. Eh. Eh okay na Philemon top. But the best, the best wale nyewe wamevangua za Arambi. Said moja ni Kwarula. Ndeka Kwarula. Vincent Kwarula. Mhm. Yes, said ingine ndai ka Francis Oduor. Kila Francis Oduor. Mhm. Uh-huh. Uli kila. Mhm. Yeye anacheza ya gol. Anacheza FC sana, afu uh-huh. nakakuja kacheza gol. Uh-huh. Then hapa katikati. Yeah. Hapa katikati ndai ka Tony Luanga. Tony Luanga nimekuwa naye under 21, nimekuwa naye eh nikakuwa naye pia Rambe. So hiyo ni baadhi ya zile generation tumecheza nao for 10 years, 10 good years. Mhm. Uh-huh. Then bado tu hapo kwa midfield ya tatu mm. niko na pass master huyu kijana ukanyaga nyasi kila pari ground mzima atakanyaga nyasi niko na Tito Mulama <laughs> niko na Tito Mulama Pamzo <laughs> la chocha <laughs> niko na Tito Mulama mzee huyu atakanyaga kila grass kwa hiyo pitch <laughs> then unajua ukiwa na Tito Mulama <laughs> mambo iko poa then <laughs> niko na Mariga niko na Donald Mariga Niko na McDonald Mariga. McDonald Mariga na mweka juu wa kreti yake pale katikati. Then ucha leni mtu huu hata akiwa kwa midfield yeye atafunga. Mhm. Uh-huh. Atumeziona kizipiga pale nyayo ama kasamani. Uh-huh. Very good goals. Uh-huh. Then up front striking uh-huh. yatu wawili. Yes. Niko na Michael Cox na niko uh-huh. na Dennis Oliech. Then Michael Cox. That is a very good stri- uh, team. Denis Oli. Ni wengi lakini kwa hii timu yako, na... kwa hii timu yako yes. coaches, nani captain? Yes. Definitely sinemi mimi. Alafu Musa ndio vice. Oja Bram, amesema gari la kitambo, eh? Unaongea na namba and then utakuza naye acha namba fulani, anasema asini mimi. Eh, ameja jiweka. So hapo kwa kapi, yeye ni mimi assistant wangu ni Musa. Iko sawa. <laughs> Eh hey, pamzo yuko hey. yako hujaniita bwana. Ai kumbe ulikuwa na chota hapa na hapa. Ah hii for long. Nilikuwa mm. na template wewe na wewe yenyewe mngekuwa kwa hiki kikosi yangu. Kwa sawa. Safi. Kapi. Ai. Hey. Hey. Ai. Hey. Hey. 
unajua unajua niliwaambia hapo ali mimi nimecheza kwa generation zote mm. na unajua sometimes unapata ga yenye siku za fabish naanza kupiga tu story siku za fabish kulikuwa gani ile kitu inaitwa ga wave mm. unajua sasa mm. kama coach unasema eh hey, jamaa mnajua ni aje yenye tuko watu wengi sana na unajua ige <laughs> Huyu coach ni mwoga. Huyu coach ni mwoga. Coach of the tens. Huyu coach ni mwoga. Musa, wacha story mob. Tupatie kikozi yako. Tupatie kikozi yako. Hivyo ndio vile la motivate wachezaji wangu. Unajua tuko wengi sana na hatuwezi cheza. So, I don't know what I'm saying. So, out wengine kama siko aita wasikie mibaya. Juu kuna game nyingine pia inaka. 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 So, mchumani Mm. Enye mimi niko na Ota. Matthews Ota Max. Eh Ota alikuwa Ota alikuwa Ota anaanza unajua aerial ball mzuri. Mm-hmm. Number 2. Mm-hmm. Ndenda kwa ZD. ZD Kaya. Yes, yeah, that's another kama ZD. That's another guy pia. Mm. Kusema tu kweli, yes, jenda na mtu kama ZD. Mm-hmm. Hapo nyuma left back. Mm. Ndenda kwa Kolo Kolo, anaitwa Francis Todor. Enye Francis alikuwa anapiga si right si left amepiga pia mabao e alikuwa yeah. flani alikuwa mpaka contender wa top, top scorer na defender sio yes yes mm. mm, kweli hoja francis ndio ni convince pia nikaingia afc hiyo ni story for another day waliepa <laughs> <laughs> naye uh, uh, francis hapo <laughs> kabla uendelee billington Billy, gera anasema hiyo line up ya, ya sami omolo ish kwani tunaenda kucheza na brazil hawa otesha endelea na mambo Uh, number 4 what uh, number 5 eh number 5 number 5 ndio cha eh ndio fala juu yale kwa la kajaga tu watu mimi nachukua ball na chenga watu ni mimi naongea okay okay sawa eh wewe kama utima bia alafu eh nenda na number 6 yenyewe kuna watu wawili wamecheza number 4 hujasema umesema 5 hujasema 4 asili kwa ni na kitambo si ni mimi oh eh nilikuwa nafikiria na Jeka Kiti. Hapana namba 4 ni mimi. Hapo namba 6 yenyewe kulikuwa na nimecheza na wachezaji kama watatu unaweza tu wanenemu. Unajua lakini nitakupatia kikosi ndani anafai kucheza. Nimecheza na mtu mmoja aitwa Abbas Amisi Magongo. Namba 6 mchonga. Eh yeye kuna namba 6 amekuwa kama Abbas Amisi Magongo. Pole pole. Musa. Ule Abbas Zamalek. Zamalek. Eh Eh basi 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 Ah ushaanguka. Sasa unatakubadilisha. Ah sijaanguka. Unataka kuchange mind nini? Ah sijaki kuchange. Unajua Musa. Eh tukise basi Musa ita let kadenge. Ah kwa sisi ni kosi yangu ama ni yangu. Haya sawa coach. Sawa coach. Ola get. Ehe. Dino mtu nimecheza naye. Eh. Ukiangalia hapo katikati again ni competition juu kuna mm. John Ebiambo Baresi mm. kuna kuna Mariga mm-hmm. kuna Mugubi mm-hmm. kuna Gaza yeah. kuna, um. kuna Baresi Katolila kutoka coast mm. unaona Kato eh Ali Break eh Ali Break Musa si name squad yako eh si name kikosi name kikosi jo name kikosi so, game nataka kuanza game inataka kuanza hey. Mchonga iko pale na anafanya vitu mm. mariga yuko hapo mm. katikati na yeye. I get at least unajua. Ni so figure ngapi Musa? Wawili tu. Kwa hiyo shida yako ni gani pamoja? Sio chaguo so, timu yako. So so hapo kwa shimo nani? Mchonga, Abbas Samisi Magongo, anacheza na na Mariga. Abbas Magongo. Yeah, anacheza na Mariga. Mariga. And then nenda on the left. Mm. On the left nenda na Taito taito na mchezesha sometimes ball ukicheza as a coach lazima uko na player mlama huyu ni tito tito mlama huyu ni tito mlama anaweza kucheza mm-hmm. katikati anaweza kucheza huko mbele taito anaweza mm-hmm. kucheza hapa katikati hapa namba 6 akaenda kule kwingine so taito iko 11 aluda anasema titus anatumia kakiti ndio mna kila mtu anataja titus lazima ataje ah, ah, tito anatembeza ah, kaimpesa saluda hiyo mimi na kuunga mkono tito ameongana hapa ah taito anajua ball alikuwa anajua ball top player top player Alafu uko juu pia unapata kulikuwa na mabuldoza, kulikuwa mm. na Mike mm-hmm. very humble, unajua ana control ball, ana speed. So mm. nikicombine Mike na Deno, mm. I think ime ime cover. Mm. Baada hapo kuweza kuwa na Mike ama Deno na Temo Diambo. Mm-hmm. 
Unaona ota 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 maxapa ota talanta si dumba na si kwenda road ota 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 Mona hiyo ndio ilikuwa hiyo ndio timu yangu. Taito anaenda kule so Sholea kuja on the left, Sholea anaenda kule katikati. So mimi nila coach. Si Deno na nani na Mike. Unalala. Mike Okoth na Deno. Eh, eh hawa wacheza juu nyingine kuna game nyingine. Chat ni wabaya tusipochagua. At least kuna game nyingine. Hii game naona hawa wachezaji ndio wazatuchezea. Nani captain wako? Ai. Captain wangu hata mimi sachukua nda party ya Mike Okoth. Eh. Sio kwa sio Michael Koth, unajua? Eh. That is another <laughs> humble gentleman. Na check it. Eh, Pamzo. Mhm. Boita alikuwa gana brother yake mwingine alikuwa gana itwa ga Otero. So anasema ni kuulize Otero ni soja. Otero bila gana. Otero bila gana. Ana ana anasema ni kuulize between Oteshe na Otero. Nani alikuwa the real Otero? Eh huyo alikuwa real Otero. Mgani? Mzee Otero. Mzee Otero ndio real Otero bila gana. Ule ule bro aboita potele mbali huko ashike gana. Ashike gana. Safi, I think imekuwa fiti eh, na na apologize sana sana nimechukua time nyingi sana sifai kuchukua time mob hivi but najua nyiko apata tena ni next year huko baadaye so I think imekuwa poa sana eh, na pale kwa comment mkipata time maze endeni muongee na watu wenyu siwezi mikuwa siwezi kuongelelea nimeshapea na credo ya sotano mara mbili ule amepata amepata Hassan Medi nitafute baadaye ni kusoti kuna kitu tumesahau kweli pamzo kuna ile kitu nilikuwa nataka kuambia Musa ile ya pale ile maeria ulimsamea ama nini ya vision ya vision show <laughs> ya vision bana tuko na 5 minutes tuko na 5 tuko na 5 minutes Musa enda naza naza sema Abraham i think uh, au vijana wa kitambo ama ma, ma players wa kitambo mm. tulikuwa tuna kulikuwa na vision na vision ilikuwa ga Oje vile Pamza jide anapenda ana lingala. Yeah. Ilikuwa at least every month kulikuwa na hiyo lingala day. Yeah. Unapata kina Dutch, kina Pamzo, anajidai wasijua kina umejiva kikofi. At least players walikuwa na itamingo la hapo, una get? Okay. Unapata hata walikuwa nakuja ku yani kusikiza muziki, yeah. wajua teamwork, team building, yeah. kila kitu ilikuwa na hapo ndio mali nilipata. Pamzo nilipata sababu alipa jita Garden Square anaweza kuambia. <laughs> Gani huyu Mungu ni wa maajabu sana. Tali ndo kwa maana alikuwa anaitoteshe. Mulika. 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 Tulia, uteshe tulia. Wacha pamza mulike. E, nini mzee wacha ze? No. Hey, Bram. Mm. Unapata after every game. Mm. Okay, the game. Mm. Maybe pia kutoeli pressure. Mm. Unaenda maybe unaenda maybe out na nini na nini. Mimi napata Musa hapo hivyo. Ati unapata Musa wapi? Egadi ni square. Egadi ni square. Sasa nilikuwa najiuliza. Eh. Eh, ukijana atacheza ball kweli. Kidogo kuzera yuko vision. Ati nasanga pana. Ukijana atacheza ball kweli. That is why nakwambia yenye God ufanya job na God yenye mzo. Okay na Musa team wa Pamzo Pamzo ilikuwaaje wewe ukweli lakini mimi huwa gana believe eh saa zingine hiyo ni poa kutoa pressure nini na nini because pia tunataka wachezaji wako na tuko nao sasa hii eh wa what is for a long time yenye to see overdue to see overdue kuna zile tuna overdue mbaki na kuwa ni mbaya sana but wewe ukienda ta out ukienda dunda kuwa very very disciplined usitoe noma usikunywe sana after hapo enda home then uta play uta play kwa muda mrefu sana. Kweli kweli. So hiyo tu ni lakini Musa yenyewe ndi acha tu tuachie hapo hiyo. Musa alikuwa jamaa wa maeria. Otesha unataka kujua utajitetea. Lakini alikuja. 
alikuja si maeri ati ni wo nini nini alikuja kabadilika maeri alikuja tu kama ali accept god bram acha nikuambie ojiwa ojo ndio nakuambia kuwa na moment alikuwa kitu poa sana because niko naendeleza ma scenario niko bado ni mwe yangu una get exactly Awa kina pamzo kuna time kwa nenda gail unaona time ya mope mote mpembe huku mm. muulize swali hii tv ilikuwa na kamera kama mambuzi mm. watu wanaenda game watu na mbaya sio hawa watoto wamejidea wameokoka tulikuwa tunakaa kule mbele watu wajui nafika gatu time, time kwa leo na angalia unaona yenyewe ni either ningie ile kwa na do ama kwa kwa situation nyingine unataka ku, ku kuingia kwa shoes zao umeona mm. hizo yeah. ma vision unasikia tizi unasikia eh tulikuwa tulikuwa wapi but again mm. in 2004 nikipata ya god uh, nye mm. life yangu i think it is the change in a way that nilijua nini papa zimu kwa hiyo world unajua mm. kama born again christian yenye mimi nashukuru hiyo decision ile make kwa sababu yenye kama kuna god mali mali yenye mali god mali yenyewe sai yenye tu kusema kweli yenyewe bram Mm. ni ukweli unajua yenyewe ni ukweli mm. but sasa yenyewe na sasa mnajua papazi yangu mm. najua attack tunafanya mm. ile gift god alinipatia yeah. najaribu tu glorify his kingdom through mm. football mm. Okay. but yes. bram kuna kitu moja nataka sana kutuseme hata sisi for my players ama federation mm. kuna life atuongelelei sana mm. kuna a transition ya players kuacha kucheza ball mm. but najua so many players struggling up mm. there umeona yeah. So many players hiyo transition life uliwacha kucheza ball doing. Unajua mm. player ataki kuona ball. Kwa mm. sababu akutrainiwa after ball what next? Mm. Una get? Mm. Unaona? Mm. Kuna former players that are crying. Mm. Crying silently. Unaona? So tunasema nini? Sasa leo mtu amecheza. Tuna train not the job baada ya kuwa kwa athlete. What happens? Yeah. Umeona? Mm. Eh? Unaona? So you know something we need to check and how we help these former players or to the ball netball volleyball what are they doing like feel you kwaje your transition is very hard mimi yenyewe kitu nisaidia hata hata into coaching za kucheza ball santos nilianza coach immediately at santos so transition ilikuwa a bit easier kwangu umeona but players are suffering what to say never that one is a bit difficult to our former players What can you do to help them? Kuoleta pamoja na kuonyesha kuonyesha What can we do to help our former players? I think hiyo ni discussion ndakuwa nayo next week na ile panel da, na, na, na papa skuleta hapa next week so we'll we'll touch a bit more on that. Ishmael Culture okay. Samuel usijali ni sikuwa nimeona comment yako but uh, I think I'll address it in the next one. <coughs> Sheikh Presda bariko abao abuao Odipo na kila mtu ule ame, ame tune in kwa show mazee na shukuru sana. Sorry kwa kuchukua time yenu mingi sana show ina kwa gani wana hawa but no, leo no, no. juu ju ya hiki kosi nzito ilibidi tucheze rough kidogo. Na mkiangalia nyuma yangu kuna kuna t-shirt na kuna reflectors. Enda kwa inbox yangu ama kwa page yangu pale kwa kwa kwa, kwa nini kwa page yangu nominate eh, watu wako wa mtaa alafu eh, watu tutawapelekea hizi ma hizi ma reflector nakupatia ziko kadhaa so if there's anyone ule ana feel kuna watu wake wa ndudhi mta because safety pia inakuja na hizi ma reflector if you have people wale wako mta pale na wana ride ma ndudhi na una feel wana need reflectors hit me up enda pale kwa wali yangu niambie why you need, uh, you need the reflectors and then we'll organize on how you get them ule mtu wote ule ana watch show na anataka t-shirt nitumie message kwa whatsapp kwa inbox na utajishindia hapo tisho katasi of betika. Sami Omolo, Musa Utieno, asanteni sana sana sana. Thank you guys for your time and I'll catch you on the next episode.